Happy Tuesday, everybody. Welcome to Epcot. <laughs> we won't be staying here at Epcot very long. Don't worry. We are headed up to the monorail to go to Magic Kingdom. Yep. Thank you guys so much for joining us today. We're very excited for our park hop and stream. Thank you guys so much for being here. We just wanted to start off with the beautiful view here of Spaceship Earth, the flag. It's just gorgeous. It really is. <laughs> exactly, Plymouth Rock. That's a great screenshot. Thank it you. Is. Does anyone know why the flag is at half staff today? Because that's, uh, that's something that just struck me. I, I don't know uh, what may have happened today, but... Uh... Oh my goodness, I bet we're not even in uh, 1080p today, are we? Oh, this, okay, understood. Yeah, I didn't think about that, I'm sorry. Yeah, we're not even in uh, 1080p today, guys. So sorry about that, we're in 720p. Uh, just hang on, I don't think I can change that during the live. Uh, let's try to refresh real quick and let's see whether or not we can change it that way. Yeah, that would be good. Hold on, everybody. <laughs> It's doing the weird screen thing. Is it? Let me try changing the cameras. All right. I th why are we? S okay. All right. There we go. Yep. I think we're good, guys. Sorry about that. Um, is it now on 1080p? It should now be on 1080p. All right. So, guys, if you would like to uh, refresh and make sure your settings are on 1080p, we should be on that. And thank you everybody for answering that question. I apologize. I, I should have known better. I, yeah. Anyway, welcome in everybody. It's good to see you all. It all is right. a hot, hot day here yeah. in Orlando, Florida today. We disappear for a few um, days. We come back and it's, uh, <laughs> we're on the surface of the sun now. What happened? I know last I checked the temperature was like, feels like a hundred something. And I'm like, oh no, what happened <laughs> to that nice, not a hundred and something. I still have my coat out, like from the other day when we were at the uh, Contemporary. Like the other week it was nice and cold, and now we're at 100, and I'm like, no, bring back the nice cold weather. We're quickly, quickly getting to a Florida summer. Here comes monorail, is that teal? I Cyan? can't even see Likely. what you're seeing. Fair. I hope it's not teal. You don't like Ron, teal? Well, Ron was on teal the other day and there was no air conditioning. Oh no, I hope. <laughs> I hope they fixed the AC since then. I remember the color of the ones that don't work. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Palm you would say 88 degrees, 40% humidity there right now. Okay, the yeah. humidity level at least is not as bad, but yeah, the heat is just a scorcher today. It is. All right, we'll be saying hi to everybody here momentarily as soon as we climb the mountain. What are you thinking, to honey? To the right, because I right? heard a big cough to the left. On the ship. To the right, we will go. Right here? Huh? Right here? Yeah. Okay. So welcome in, everybody. Good to see you all. Thank you so much for being here. We did refresh just a moment ago, so if you're not live with us, go ahead and check your live indicator. Make sure that it is red. If it is not, go ahead and refresh so that you can join us live. We'd really appreciate that. It's good to see each and every one of you. Thank you for being here. If you've not already, please pop that like button, tap that like button, hit that like button, whatever verb you want to use. We'd really appreciate that. It helps us out tremendously. We'll be making our way over to the Magic Kingdom in just a moment. Well, first we gotta go to the TTC. Oh yeah, so, yeah. this does take us to the, the TTC. The monorail here it? at Epcot will take you to the Ticket and Transportation Center. Yep. The TTC. And then from there, we hop on the monorail to the Magic Kingdom. Right. And then we'll be at the Magic Kingdom. <laughs> All right, let's say hi to everybody. Sounds good to me. All right, let's start here. I see Jonathan Russo, welcome in. Hey, Jonathan. Jason Mex, welcome in. Hey, Jason. Grasshopper, Grasshopper's wife, Little Grasshopper, welcome in. Hey, Grasshopper, Grasshopper's wife and Little Grasshopper. <laughs> JJ Mickey, welcome in. Hey, JJ Mickey. Marty M, welcome in. Hey, Marty M. Andrew, welcome. Welcome in, Andrew. Three Musketeers, Bex and Andy, welcome in. Hey, Three Musketeers, Bex and Andy. Steven Singleton, welcome in. Good to see you, uh, good to see you Steven. <laughs> Mario Corrales, welcome in, Mario. Hey, Mario. Let's see here. Is it teal? It's uh -oh. teal. Hopefully, if it is 
the same till that Ron was on the other day. The AC is working. <laughs> JB Bassin, welcome in, JB. Hey, JB. Oh, JB says, time to clock out of work, clock into fun. Hello, park hoppers, still for the stream. Have so much fun. Thank you so much, JB. Thank you, JB. Welcome in, Paul Newitt. Welcome in, Average Joe. Hey, Paul. Hey, Joe. Welcome in, the shift manager. Hey, shift manager. Welcome in, Spencer Tim. Hey, Spencer. Welcome in, Beaker and Honeydew. Hey, Beaker and Honeydew. Welcome in, Holly M. Hey, Holly. Let's see who else we have with us. Carrie M, welcome in. Hey, Carrie. Lucky Dude, welcome in. Hey, Lucky Dude. Gary G, welcome in. Hey, Gary G. Welcome in, Alexander Lee. Hey, Alexander. Jeremy Heath, welcome in. Hey, Jeremy. Crystal Coachman, welcome in. Hey, Crystal. Plymouth Rock, welcome in. Hey, Plymouth Rock. John Wood, welcome in. Hey, John. I was like, oh, there might be seats on the other side. Yeah. Oh, do you want to run over there? Oh, no. There's not much space anyways. We'll gotcha. just end. All right. Who else is here? Chris B. Welcome in. Hey, Chris. Welcome in, Craig's Robotics. Hey, Craig. Welcome in, Passion to Disney. Hey, Passion. Welcome in, Bravo Zulu. Hey, Bravo. Let's see. Who else? Who else? Alyssa Steinberg. Welcome in. Hey, Alyssa. Try not to miss anybody. Yeah. Welcome in uh, Colin Cropley. Hey Colin. Welcome in Kelly Snyder. Hey Kelly. Welcome in James Sisson. Hey James. All right, I think I got to the top of my chat now. <laughs> <laughs> All right, if anybody is here. Oh, hello Prince Ryan, welcome in. Hey Prince Ryan. Leanne, welcome in. Hey Leanne. Brian K, welcome in. Hey Brian. Mouse ears and beers, welcome in. Hey Mouse ears. Welcome in Mac Dog. Hey Mac Dog. All right, I think I'm caught up with everybody in chat. So if I haven't said hi to you, please say hi. Absolutely. <laughs> and uh, welcome in all Ninja Watchers, of course. Thank you guys so much for being here. Oh, and I see Anthony the Molder Man. Welcome in, Anthony. Kawaii Kitty's also here. Welcome in. Hey, Anthony. Hey, Kawaii Kitty. All right, I think I'm going to hold on so I don't fall. Oh no, it was frozen. Sorry about that, JB. Welcome in. We were frozen? Hopefully not. Hopefully not. Jeremy Heath says, hey, Black Hoppers, waiting on my kids to get home from school. They were in lockdown today. Oh, no. Sorry about that, Jeremy. Hopefully all is okay, Jeremy. Okay, Jay Dino, welcome in, Kirsty. Hey, Kirsty. Yes, sir. <laughs> JP Basson said my phone was acting a donkey. Oh, uh, I feel that. As long as it's not, well, like, you are a donkey because you are cute. Yeah. AC is blowing strong, Maria. Thank goodness. Welcome in, Autumn and Eeyore. Speaking hey, of donkey, because Eeyore, you know, Eeyore is donkey. <laughs> that is true. I love Eeyore, guys, in case you didn't know. He's my mom's favorite. <laughs> Boy, it's a beautiful day outside if you're in air conditioning. Yeah, in the shade and in air conditioning, two, two things you need for it to feel nice. Hey, welcome in, Scott Obert. Hey, Scott, welcome in. It's a pretty empty parking lot for Epcot during spring break. There's so many spots open. There is? Yeah. Now, why do we park so far? <laughs> It is strange though, I agree. It is. Alright guys, we are making our way to the TTC. And then once we get to the TTC, the Ticket Transportation Center, we will be taking the monorail to the Magic Kingdom. Yep, yep. Oh, it's a shaky monorail today. <laughs> JV cut a four pounder on his lunch break with his first cast. What? Nice, JV. That's awesome. Hey, Jenny Reed, welcome in. Hey, Jenny. Hey, Jenny. Welcome in, Jenny. Hey, Jenny. Hey, Jenny. Oh, boy. <laughs> I'm 
one is trying to move with the movement. Yeah. Like a, surfing, stable as like possible. a surfing thing? Oh no. Boy, Kitty said, be right back. My son just spilled ice cold water all over me. Wee, free splash mountain. Oh my goodness, that is like free splash mountain. You like the way, Kitty? Oh, I think we just lost it. Oh no. I think we're back. Sort of. We may come in and out a bit uh, on our journey, guys. Just hang in there. We will uh, be at the Magic Kingdom in a little bit. This is all part of park hopping. Yeah, Sorry about that, guys. Chef manager is asking, are we doing enchantment tonight or pardon me? So if we stick around for the fireworks tonight, we will be over in Epcot, so we'll catch Harmonious tonight. Yeah. Uh, our very last time catching Harmonious will be tomorrow night. Yeah, tomorrow is like our main focus will definitely be to uh, enjoy Harmonious as much as we possibly can, get the best spot, because uh, tomorrow will be our last time watching Harmonious before it changes to Epcot forever. And then on Friday will be our very last enchantment. Uh, so again, we'll be wanting to uh, make full use of the time there to make sure that we get as good a spot as possible for enchantment because uh, we're going to miss these shows. Uh, we will. But we're looking forward to the new shows as well. We will. <laughs> KJ Christie's like, the park hoppers are hopping. Hooray! Hooray! <laughs> <laughs> or hurrah. I always think hooray. I don't know why. Same idea. Yeah. Well, we'll soon be seeing all the uh, construction happening over at the Polynesian for the DVC building here. That is true. In just a moment. Oh, will we? Oh, you did. Like, it's like, right, I see it in the horizon at least. Oh, fair. But we won't be going by it because we're going to be on the express monorail, which will take us through contemporary over to Magic. Oh, that's true. Ted Van Lar, welcome in. Ted says, concert are we going to and when? Hey, Ted. Well, Ted, we are currently on our way to the Magic Kingdom. We uh, just hopped on the monorail from Epcot. We're going to the TTC. Once we get to the TTC, we'll be taking another monorail to the Magic Kingdom, and we'll be enjoying all the things over there. Yeah. And then we'll be hopping over to Epcot later. Well, as for a concert, we're going to be seeing uh, Neil on the piano today. Oh yeah, definitely Neil. Uh, we might catch a different band today, I don't know. Um, and then our next concert concert, I'm not sure. We'll yeah. have to see, uh, we'll we'll see, see how it goes. Yep. Yeah, but definitely Neil on the piano, <laughs> for sure. Welcome in, Mel. Hey, Mel. Great to see you. Wow, the TTC is pretty empty. Don't jinx anything. I think it's just so hot. It is very, very hot. Let's see what the weather app says. If I can press the right button. Magic Kingdom. Oh, it's gone down a lot from the last time I checked, at least. What, the wait times or the no, temperature? No, temperature I'm checking. Oh, good. It says 89 feels like 93 for the next four hours. That's not bad. 93 is better than 100. Yeah, it certainly is. So that's good. Hey, welcome in, Jennifer Caruso. Hey, Jennifer, welcome in. Andrew, we have not seen John Wick 4 yet. Oh, no, but that looks like an awesome movie. Have you seen it? Well, thank you so much, Jeremy Heath. We appreciate that. Oh, thank you, Jeremy. Yeah, see, here you'll see the construction of the poly a little bit. True. Oh, Andrew hasn't seen it yet. It looks like a really cool movie, though. It does. We're big fans of uh, Keanu Reeves. He's like amazing. Mm -hmm. All right, guys. We'll fix uh, the fact that the screen is crooked here in a moment. Let me see if I can go ahead and do that. What is your vlog? Oh. <laughs> oh, yeah, that'd be awesome. Uh, we're currently live streaming on YouTube. We're on Park Hoppers. Yeah. The logo looks like that. Okay. Yeah, we try to live stream from the parks as much as we can. Oh no, thank you. We appreciate it. <laughs> thank you. Welcome in, Matt, to the bone. Good to see you, sir. Ab, oh. welcome in. 
Add to the phone. Welcome. Welcome, NAB. All right. We are at the TTC. And now we're going to crash the monorail to the Magic Kingdom. Yep. Can we cross over or do we have to go down? Nope. Got to go down. Oh, gotcha. Yep. Oh, sorry about that, Beaker and Honeydew. You guys should be back. <laughs> Thank you, guys. Right, guys. There we go. That should be better. Sorry about that better lag, everybody. I accidentally locked the phone. <laughs> Honey, if I can have you take the gimbal. Oh, now. I was going to hand sanitize really oh, okay, quickly. Gotcha. No worries. Just because I was holding the. Uh, real football? quite tightly because yeah. the Monroe is going kind of crazy. I understood. Let me welcome just... in, Football 12. Hey, Football 12, welcome in. So, guys, we are at the TTC. We're making the exchange over to the Express Monorail, which will take us straight to the Magic Kingdom. All right, I'll take the gimbal. Thank you. Yeah, we already went through security and all that fun stuff. So. Monorail to the Kingdom is here. Monorail for the Resort Hotel is over there in the very all right, hopefully we catch this one. This one is no, Monorail Peach. This right. one's leaving, I believe. Is it leaving? We're not going to make... Oh, yeah, no, we're not going to make this one. Unless it just got here. Oh, it just got here. Excellent. Oh, did it? Oh, welcome back, Kawaii Kitty. Hey, Kawaii Kitty. Hopefully that was refreshing, Kawaii Kitty. <laughs> Paul, yes, thank you. Paul's just giving us a reminder to hydrate today. Thank it you, is Paul. a hot one. Thank you, Paul. All right. Let's All right, catch honey. a cab. I'll follow you. All right. Thank you. Oh, they went the way I thought. Over okay. here, thanks. Gotcha. Sounds good. Hang on, everybody. Oh, Whoop, that was loud. So we are on the monorail, everybody. Hey, welcome in Shannon D for Disney. Welcome hey, in Shannon. Charlie Orlando. Hey, Charlie Orlando. Yes, we are feeling much better now. Thank you so much, Charlie. Thank you, Charlie. We uh, wanted to make sure that we were exercising in abundance of caution. Someone was kind enough to share. <laughs> <laughs> some germs with us and we didn't want to uh, share with everybody else so that's right <laughs> exactly Jenny <laughs> oh, no, you're okay. well, well thank, thank you, you so much Matt to the bone <laughs> thank, thank you Kawaii Kitty thank, thank you guys you, Final boarding call. Oh, and KJ Dino Kirsty, happy belated birthday to your daughter. Happy belated birthday to Kirsty. Hope daughter. you guys had an awesome time. Absolutely. Grasshopper said, didn't know you guys were under the weather. Hate to hear that. Glad you feel better, though. Thank yeah. You so much, Thank you so much, Grasshopper. Thank you, guys. All right, guys, so we're going to be taking the Express Monorail around to the Magic Kingdom. Gates are closing right now, which means the doors are about to close. Did us. Welcome in, Nicky Mouse. Nicky Mouse, welcome in. <laughs> we're back, Nicky. What happened? She said, yay, you're back. <laughs> yes. We're in Monorail Peach, guys, headed towards the Magic Kingdom. Yep. Just left Monorail 2 from Epcot. You want to turn it around and say hi to everybody? Sure. Just while we have a before we're like in 10 pounds of like sweat. gross sweat. Yeah. yeah. I mean, Hello, it's everybody. already happened, but like it's going to get worse. Yeah, with this kind of temperature, I step outside and I start sweating. Yeah, it's so hot today. I think about outside and I start sweating. And it's only going to get hotter because, you know, summertime. So. Yeah. All right, turn All it around and show everything pretty outside. Just wanted to say hello to everybody personally. So hi everybody. 
Oh, thank you, Kawaii Kitty. It's the uh, Vans Disney um, collaboration bucket hat. I love it so much. <laughs> Beaker and Honey Deer are like, the white hat, hat is in the house. Woohoo! In the house? <laughs> yeah, anytime we go out and like, it's gonna be really hot, we always uh, opt for our white hats. I think uh, if we ever do do merchandise, and we do hats and uh, bucket, bucket hats, hats, our first hat's gonna have to be white. Or at least a light color. Especially for the, you know, when you're visiting the parks, it's good for the daytime. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, Nicky Mouse. <laughs> oh, AB's gonna be here in three months. Oh, yeah, it's gonna be hot then. Yep. Be, be prepared. prepared <laughs> Kawaii's like jealous of those blue skies. Oh, yeah, it's beautiful today outside of the temperature. <laughs> oh, enjoy the Easter eggs of the Grand Floridian Jennifer. Sweet. Our losing signal a little bit, but I think we're keeping it still. It's it's gonna be a fun uh, fun day, I think, with all the people here in the heat. But <laughs> yeah, and exactly, Jenny. The Florida humidity is rough, especially during the summertime. Oh yeah. Here hey, welcome in. Amanda loves to travel. Hey, Amanda. Welcome to the contemporary. Feels like we just went inside. <laughs> because the sun's not beating down on you anymore. It does feel like nice a lot seat. cooler, oddly enough. Uh, Kirsty says, Monica, we had an early celebration with Trudy and family. It's actually her 30th birthday today. Oh, okay. That's awesome. She's having a wonderful day and week. That's fantastic. Well, happy actual birthday to Trudy today. <laughs> That's happy awesome. Happy actual birthday to Trudy. <laughs> oh, my goodness. Oh, oh I knew it. You All want right. me to turn it around? Well, I think if you, like, outside's prettier because, like, pretty. we're showing all, like, the pretty stuff. Um, Paul Newitt sent us a $10 super chat. Says, four drinks to our favorite Disney streamers on a hot day. Enjoy. Thank you so much, Paul. Thank you very, very much, Paul. Very much appreciated. We are almost to the Magic Kingdom, everybody. Almost there. Nikki Mouse says, on my phone, so I can't tag everyone, but I hope everyone can feel this giant bear hug I'm sending. Oh, well, thank you, Nikki. Well, giant bear hugs back at you, Nikki. Thank right? you. I still feel like we're crooked, which is weird. I'll get that fixed, though. Jimmy Tiger PT in the house. Welcome in, Jimmy Tiger. Hey, Jimmy. Good to see you, sir. And Brian K just shared out our Instagram link. Thank you so much, Brian. Thanks, Guys, Brian. we do have, uh, other than YouTube, we have Instagram and TikTok. We also have Twitter, but mostly Instagram and TikTok. So yeah, if you guys would like to Twitter. join us on there and follow along, that would be awesome. Check it out. The Mickey Bunch. Welcome in, Kelly. Hey, Kelly. Great to see you. All right, we are pulling into the monorail up here, monorail station, whatever you want to call it. <laughs> We are at the Magic Kingdom now. We made it. We made it. Let's go get in the front gate. Oh yeah. Well, we have to enter the front gate, yes. Yeah. That's true. Just in time for that cavalcade too, the uh, celebration cavalcade. Awesome. Let's go check it out, everybody. Good afternoon, Patrick Julian. Good Welcome to see you. Welcome in, Patrick Julian. And thank you so much. We appreciate that. Oh yeah. I'm not. <laughs> ah. ah, the sun scorcher. Um, I didn't put any uh, suntan lotion on today, so I'm gonna look like I have been fried by the end of the day. <laughs> I always try to get him to wear sunscreen, but... 
if I wear He's sunscreen, a I'll always be pale as a ghost, though. <laughs> <laughs> Welcome in, Theo Sam Eagle. Hey, Theo. Welcome in, Hope. Hey, Hope. Oh, in the shade, it's really nice, guys. But in the sun, it's uh, very, very hot. Yep. As is the way with Florida. But welcome, everybody, to the Magic Kingdom. Oh, fireworks. Oh, yep, that's from the, the uh, stage show. Exactly. What do you mean that's for the stage show? No, no, no. Disney just does that whenever the park hoppers show up. They're oh, like, oh, here comes that? the park hoppers. Okay. Some awesome. fireworks. <laughs> There's nobody down there. Do you want to just go down there? Yeah, wherever you want to go. Yeah. There's the train. Hello, everybody. Always good. Yourself? I'm good, man. If you want the band, you can figure out the scanner. You got it. There we go. All right, Monica, you're gonna thank, thank you. Thank you. Yeah. Eric, you're as well. Have a great day. Thank you so much, sir. Thank you. Oh, they're so personal. Right? <laughs> that was nice. Right? So welcome to the Magic Kingdom, everybody. What have I missed here? Oh, goodness. Yes, please, if you have not already, please uh, hit that like button. We'd really appreciate it, everybody helps us out tremendously. If you are new here, we are Eric Monica, we are the Park Hoppers. We go live from the parks quite often now. And uh, yeah, if you'd like to come along with us to Magic Kingdom, to Epcot, Animal Kingdom, MGM, hey, Disney Springs, wherever we'll be at Disney Resort, uh, please consider hitting that subscribe button and we'd love to take you along with us. Do I see Corn Dog Jimmy? Corn Dog Jimmy's here. Welcome. All right, I think we're back. That was a weird uh, blip and signal. But we are back, everybody. Welcome in, Poppy. Hey, Poppy. I think the signal is going to be doing weird things today, strictly because it's hot. It is very hot. Do you want to stand here for the cavalcade, or where? Oh, I was More thinking someplace way? in the shade, honey. Oh, by Casey's? Yeah, maybe by Casey's. That'd be great. Yeah. 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 Then we'll go catch Neil right after. Sounds like a good plan to me. You want to? Okay. Yeah, we'll go I'll follow the... you. Okay. Welcome in, J-Rock Does Stuff. Hey, J-Rock Does Stuff. Good to see you. Welcome in, Valerie G. Hey, Valerie. Welcome in, Julianne. Hey, Julianne. Okay. We're walking right down the middle of Main Street, everybody. It's kind of surprising. Welcome in, Dance. What? Welcome in. It's what kind of surprising that it's even possible for us to walk down the middle of Main Street right now. It's been so busy the last few days. It is still a little bit busy, though. Oh, it's very busy. Welcome in Dan's life at the Kingdom. Hey, Dan. All right, I think we should make our way over to the sidewalk now. Welcome in Isabel Fidel. Hey, Isabel. Welcome in that Florida feeling. Welcome in that Florida feeling. Ooh, the AC from the Emporium felt good. Yes, but we cannot stop them. Get used to that air conditioning. Nope. It is hot. Yes, it is. But if we get too comfortable with that air conditioning, we're in trouble. Yep. Become complacent and not want to leave. <laughs> welcome in, Rachel Y. Hey, Rachel Y. Not sure if I said hi to Greg, but welcome in, Greg Titus. Hey, Greg Titus. I don't think we did. Welcome in, Greg. I'm not sure. If we say hi to you guys twice, we're sorry. Just want to make sure we say hi. All right. We get bubbles right here. What happened? What do you think? Is this the spot you want? I think so. We can move further down, but we're probably going to catch some sun. Yeah, this is think? fine here. Yeah. Um, let me just switch over here. Sounds good to me. All right, guys, welcome in. We are waiting for the uh, Celebration Cavalcade, which just started over in Frontierland about one, min one minute ago. So they're walking this way right now. We will be seeing them shortly. Welcome in, Tyler, Eric. Hey, Tyler. You okay, girl, Julia? You may want to stand a little bit more forward just so you don't like lose your right, right. spot whenever you can. Thank you. I was going to hand you uh, the gimbal. If that's oh, yeah, right. I'll hold the gimbal for sure. Thank you. Hey, 
think we had somebody else join us. I'm not sure. Oh yes, Terry Klaus. Welcome in, Terry. Hey, Terry. In Plymouth Rock, I was like, the AC is called and it's called. And <laughs> yeah, the AC feel feels... Just a little bit from Casey's, I think, right here. A little bit. Welcome in, Gary. Gary Orn is here. Keep drinking water. Yes, we need to hydrate for sure. Hey, Gary. Welcome in, Egg663. Hey, Egg. Kawaii Kitty says we're three likes to 100. Oh, Thank that's you amazing, so much, guys. guys. Thank if you so much. If you haven't much. already, please pop the like button. Tap the like button. Click the like button. Hit the, the like button. The one with the thumbs up. I saw Plymouth Rock <laughs> said he's a carpenter, so he would hammer the like button. Hammer the like button. There you go. All the things. All right. Welcome in, Josh. Hey, Josh. Getting all set up for this cavalcade. Yeah, the Mickey Celebration cavalcade is on the way, guys. And once that's over, we'll be going over to the Casey's Corner Pianist, which is Neil today. We'll go yes. pay Neil a visit. For sure. Welcome in, JB United 11. JB says England 2 1, Italy, England 2 0, Ukraine. I'm not sure what that means, but Eric knows. <laughs> Sounds good, JB. <laughs> Oh, let's see here. Welcome in, Turn Spencer Tim. Welcome in, Richard Taylor. Richard Taylor from Canada. Oh, oh it must feel so nice right now in Canada. <laughs> it's very warm here in Florida. Granted, maybe you're thinking the same thing in reverse. Probably. That's probably the case. What's All that right. saying? The grass is always greener on the other side? On the other side. But yeah, I'm just showing you guys the awesome views of uh, down Main Street here at the castle. Absolutely. Welcome in, D.W. Harwich. Hey, D.W. Good to see you, sir. All right, let's click you guys in place. There we are. Nice. We're over 100 likes already. Thank you, everybody. Thank you, guys. We really appreciate that. Welcome in, Rebecca M.W. Hey, Rebecca. Welcome in, Carla and Kiko Adventures. Hey, Carla and Kiko. Happy belated birthday, Kiko. Happy belated birthday, Kiko. We very much enjoyed that luau yesterday. We're like... Yes, we would like to be at the Luau too. Yes. <laughs> and I too would be uh, screaming at the top of my lungs because that seems like a lot of fun. It sure did. We're like, that's awesome. <laughs> oh boy. But it yeah, in the shade, don't get us wrong, in the shade it feels really nice. It does. It's just in the sun when it's warm. <laughs> yeah, the breeze mixed with uh, the 90 degrees that it is right now is not that bad in the shade. Yeah. In the sun, oh my goodness. House Cut says, welcome in House Cut. What are your first names? Oh, uh, you want to turn around and say? Hey, House Cut. Yeah. We'll turn it around really quickly and then we'll turn it back Sounds to the castle. Good to me. Just to say who we are and what we do. So, so hello everybody. Okay. You Go can, ahead, Annie. You can take. Oh, yours. Okay. I did it last time. <laughs> Guys, we are the Park Hoppers. My name is Monica. And this I'm Eric. This is Eric. Yes, we are the Park Hoppers. We are. And we live stream on YouTube primarily. Um, we also have a TikTok and an Instagram. But YouTube's where it's at, so if you want to join us for adventures, please consider subscribing and ringing that notification bell. Make sure it's set to all notifications, that way you'll always be alerted when we go live. Yep. And if you haven't already, bop, tap, click, hammer that like button, that yep. would be awesome. All the verbs. All the verbs, all the things. We really and appreciate that, guys. And if you're new you. here, uh, please consider subscribing. We'd love to have you along with us on our future adventures. Yes. Thank you so much, guys. And now we're going to turn it back around to enjoy the beautiful castle. Let's do it. Got a bubble in my mouth. Oh, that no. was delicious. So <laughs> hydrating. Not really, guys. Don't do you eat. Do you want some water? Yeah. Okay. Don't eat bubbles, guys. We don't recommend it. <laughs> Here we go. Oh, goodness, really? Yep. Uh, just got a whiff of something you should uh, not be doing at the parties. Yep. But uh, that was, yeah, interesting. It happens. Welcome in, Walt Swafford. Hey, Walt Swafford. Oh, thank you so much, Valerie. Yes, I love this Disney Vans bucket hat so much. I know I've told you guys before, I always wanted to buy a second one, but by the time I realized I wanted a second one, they were sold out everywhere. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Nikki Mouse says, wait, I can't eat bubbles, but why? <laughs> Well, Nikki, you can eat bubbles if you want to. We're not going to like tell you not to do something that you want to do. It would all depend on what it's made from. Yeah, some bubbles are actually are edible. They are. But um, the ones in the Disney ones are, um, they taste like soap. They, well, they should. So, like, they are soap. 
Well, yeah, they're very soapy. <laughs> heavy Metal Crone, welcome in. Great to see you again. Hey, Heavy Metal Crone. Just got off work and logged onto your stream. Thank you so much. Well, thank you so much, man. <laughs> Mickey Mouse is like, they taste like laundry. <laughs> yeah, pretty much. Well, while we're waiting on this cavalcade, everybody, has anyone ever noticed the flowers above the uh, ice cream store here? The ice cream parlor? There's flowers up there? Are they new for like, because it's springtime now? I don't know. I just saw them swinging over here and I'm like, huh. Maybe they refresh them. Maybe. They're very pretty. Because they are like, they're spring colored, right? Or is it just me? Well, they're definitely <laughs> spring colored. They might swap them out and uh, go with a different color for different seasons. Yeah, that's possible. I think so. That makes a lot of sense. I hear the cavalcade, guys. Let's turn it down Main Street a little bit here. Marty, I'm said the flowers look new. Yeah, it just it caught my attention there. I'm like, what? Uh, I don't, I'm not used to seeing that. Yeah, I think they're refreshing, you know, the decorations for the seasons. Whenever you're um, done, you just put it back in my backpack if you want. Sounds good to me. Thanks. Yep, we are now hearing the music for the Celebration Cavalcade. That is the 50th anniversary cavalcade that will no longer uh, be here at Magic Kingdom after, what, uh, Sunday? Pretty much. Because that is the end of the 50th anniversary. Ooh, Carla and Kiko and Kelly and Mickey Bunch are talking about Disneyland and Knott's Berry Adventures. We're so mm. jealous, guys. We would love to go one day. And Knott's Berry Farm looks like it has oh some amazing food. Okay, yeah, Disneyland and Knott's Berry Farm, like the food there, the, oh my gosh, it looks so delicious. Yeah, we're very jealous of, uh, of that. Uh, Vamos is not the 50th anniversary uh, cavalcade, actually, quite Kitty, so I think we'll continue to have Vamos yeah, for a while. Yeah, I think we'll, we'll continue, exactly. <laughs> like you said, um, Vamos is not part of the 50th, so thankfully we should enjoy it until, you know, Disney changes it out. Exactly. Welcome in, Francisco, uh, Francisco Fuentes. Welcome in, Francisco. What's up, guys? Thank you for your live stream. You guys are very cool. Well, thank you so much, Francisco. Thank you. Welcome in, Nathan. Which cavalcade will you miss the most when the 50th ends? I think this is the only one for the 50th, right? I'm pretty sure this is the only one that'll disappear. Yeah. So this. So one. I guess this one. Yeah. That would be the answer. <laughs> <laughs> oh, hey, more of those flowers. But like in the, uh, in the planters up here. Oh, just underneath, underneath the windows? The windows? Yeah. yeah. And guys, pretty. if you don't know, the windows um, all have different names of like past um, people who've just had such an influence on Disney, whether it be Imagineers or like Walt Disney, Roy Disney. Like, it's really like awesome Easter eggs here on everywhere in Disney, really. It really is. Welcome in, Krista Disney Baker. Good to see you, sir. Krista Disney Baker. Welcome in, Chris. Always great to see you, sir. Yeah, Jonathan says, uh, are you guys going to miss harmonious fireworks once it ends? We oh, are. my God. Yeah, like, for sure. Yeah. And if anything, just because, Jonathan, harmonious was, like, the first fireworks we enjoyed together when we started coming to the parks last year. Yep. So it's, like, very nostalgic for us in that way. Exactly. And everybody has their own reasons why they either enjoy something or don't enjoy it, but that's the reason yeah. we in particularly enjoy Harmonious and uh, Enchantment. And that's why it's going to be such a big deal to us when we uh, see our last Harmonious show on Wednesday and our last Enchantment on Friday. Yep. Yeah. Alright, here comes the cavalcade, everybody. The cast members are clearing off the main street. Yes, exactly, Prince Ryan. Get ready to answer the call. Thank you, everybody, so much for being here. Once again, we are the Park Hoppers. We're Eric and Monica. We go live from the park several times a week. And uh, we would love to take you along with us again in the future. If you please hit that subscribe button, we'd be able to uh, do it just that much easier. We sincerely appreciate it. And it supports us quite considerably, so thank you. And after you hit that subscribe button, guys, if you'll ring that notification bell, set to all notifications, it'll always alert you when we go live. Absolutely. We find it very helpful, personally. <laughs> it is. Damn, heavy metal prone, harmonious is going away. It feels like, what? <laughs> so yeah. fast. Sounds good. Uh, wait, I misread that. I'm so sorry. Sounds good, Kelly. Thank you so much. And thank you to all Ninja Watchers. We yes. really appreciate you guys. Thank you, all Ninja Watchers. Enjoy the 50th Mickey Celebration Cavalcade, which uh, 
This is, is this like the last time we're gonna see it? Oh, no, maybe tomorrow. No. We'll, we'll see it, uh, well tomorrow we'll be at Oh no, Friday, Friday. We'll see it on Friday, yep. Yeah. One of the last times we'll see it though. Yeah. Good to see you, ma'am. Welcome in to anybody who just joined us. Welcome in, Ninja Watchers. So yeah, that cavalcade's always so good because you can enjoy all like Mickey and the Fat Five. Right. Let's see here. Well, let's scoot over here a little bit, just so that we're not uh, so much behind the speaker there. You want to show inside the key, um, inside the piano since they left it open? Oh, sure. Just a little sneak peek. Well, hey there, Hello. Neil. How are you? This it's been a while. gentleman looks familiar. <laughs> Everybody say hi to Neil. Nice to see you guys. How's it going? <laughs> Always good. Always, Always good. good. Especially it's, in the shade. It's gotten a lot hotter. And my feet are Oh, good. Yes. <laughs> oh, here they come. Here they come. Here comes the team. Five. Yeah, Five. Are we going to have to forfeit the game? Uh -oh. We're going to have to forfeit the game. <laughs> Hi. Hi. Oh, do you want to play? Get us oh. suited up. We'll go play. There you go. Suited up? Oh, boy. <laughs> <laughs> Welcome in, Shempy. Hey, Shempy. Yeah, I think the last oh, time we saw... Uh, go ahead. The last time we saw Neil, they hadn't fixed the uh, chair yet. Yeah, they fixed the chair and the fan. Those are good, good things. Absolutely. And thank you so much, Kawaii Kitty, guys. That is Neil's link for YouTube, his YouTube channel. If you guys want to check it out and subscribe, that would be awesome. That would be. Thank you, everybody. Yes, it is almost time for taking us to the ball game. They uh, call it their seventh inning stretch, I believe, right? Welcome in, Justin Frank. Hey, Justin Frank. <laughs> you know, with five people, that just means they're going to have to yell it as loud as they possibly can. That's possible. <laughs> <laughs>
Wow, it's it's a warm day. It is very, very much a warm day. <laughs> well, thank you so much, Shimpy. We appreciate that very much. And yes, Greg Titus, I'm sorry, I just saw your question. Uh, he's asking if we're still going to Epcot tonight. Of course, today is a park hopping stream, guys. Absolutely. We started at Epcot. I mean, technically, we did park hop over to Magic. True. But we will be park hopping back to Epcot. <laughs> exactly. Exactly. One way or the other, we have to. We're parked over there. Yeah. <laughs> oh, thank you, Shumpy. <laughs> All right, guys, they're about to get started. All right, guys, we hope you enjoy, Neil. Enjoy, guys. Welcome in, Jeff Condon. Hey, Jeff Condon.
looks like the heat hasn't slowed you down one bit. Oh man. Well, thank you for that, Neil. How's your day? Oh, warm. Yours? Warm, but otherwise it's been good. We're gonna go and catch the cavalcade now and the hoedown, and yep. then we'll be back. Yep. Cavalcade and hoedown, and then you'll be yes, back. Yes, sir. Yes. 5.30, right? Yeah, all right. We'll see you in a minute. <laughs> Not to say we're gonna go in the hoedown. We're gonna uh, we're gonna view the hoedown. We don't go. we don't know you're how to hold down. You, you can't say no if Big L asks you though. Okay, if Big L asks me, I'll do this. There you go. Trying to sit still during the hoedown. It is. Well, thank you again, Neil. We see really appreciate later, it. Neil. And guys, if you want to see more of Neil, he's got an awesome YouTube channel that's been dropped a couple times here. Guys, go over and check him out. Drop him a subscription or anything. Uh, leave him a comment on your favorite uh, video. It really does. It's it's very supportive. It's very helpful. And we really appreciate it, guys. Thank you yes. so much. Thank you, Neil. Thank we'll you, be back. Neil. <laughs> a square dancing call. Yeah, you know the guy. Okay, to the right, to the right, to the left. The guy that's doing like square dancing. Yeah. Grab your partner, swing him around. He's yeah. like the caller. Oh, so really? So he would yell out the directions. And I met him over at Rosencrown last week. I've Rosen ground of all places. Yeah, of all places. He's like, yeah, I used to be in an entertainment tour. I'm like, really? What did you do? I guess I was a, a, a like, a, Hold a, up. Yeah. a square dancing caller. I mean, I guess that's a gig, and I didn't even think that's about awesome. it. That's awesome. Somebody's doing it. Somebody's, somebody's got to do it, right? Yeah. Who's saying that? You, you, know? you need to know what to do. You do? <laughs> Sorry, guys. See you later, awesome. Neil. Thank you, Neil. All right. Let's go get a spot for the cavalcade. Sounds good to me. Near where the hoedown will happen. Yep, gotta make our way over to Frontierland. Do you mind holding my phone for just You got it, honey. Thanks. Okay, got it. Got Thank it? you. Yep. Does anybody in chat know how to hoe down? <laughs> is, it, <laughs> is that the right terminology even? Oh, it's, it's square dancing. Oh, square dancing. There yeah. we go. You know, grab your partner. Grab oh, grab thank back. you guys so much for subscribing to Neil. Thank we'll you, enjoy, everybody. We'll um, enjoy the musical signs of Neil again at 5.30. We certainly uh, will. For sure, because, like, he's amazing. Yes. <laughs> welcome in, everybody. I saw a few friends join us. Emily, LSU mom, welcome in. Movie Mania, Nick, welcome in. Hey, Emily. Hey, Nick. Vicky Gillespie, welcome in. Hey, Vicky. Welcome in, Rand's Adventures. Hey, Rand. All right, guys. Let's Cutting see. through the crowd a little bit here. Rob, aka Disney MUK, welcome in, Rob. Hey, Rob. I'm sure there's a lot of other people I might be missing, so I'm sorry. <laughs> if I am, just say hey in chat. And if you don't want to say hey, that means you're a ninja watcher. So, hey, ninja watchers. Welcome in, ninja watchers. It's good to see you all. Thank you for being here. Let's cross run on the, the go. We're never running. Run. <laughs> run on the go. Says, why are we running? Running where? We're just copying Ron right now by going over to Frontierland for this uh, for this hoedown <laughs> thing we saw him do the other day. Well, yeah, the hoedown looked like so much fun. And it like did. Chip and Dale as like little cowboys and Big Al and like the other country bears. <laughs> That's pretty awesome, right? I think so. Marius, welcome in from Norway. Hey, Marius. Thank you so much for joining us. If you missed Neil earlier, we will be back at 5.30 to enjoy his musical stylings. We it's currently 5.03 here in Orlando, Florida. Hey, Debbie Sanderson. Hey, thank Debbie. You, thank you so much for subscribing. Oh, thank uh, you for subscribing, Debbie. We appreciate that so much. We do. And guys, if you have yet to subscribe, if you would consider subscribing, that really, really supports our channel. And if you ring that notification bell and set notifications to all, that would be awesome too. Yep, that way you know every time we go live. For sure. Welcome in, Gray Architect. Hey, Gray Architect. Welcome in, JC. Hey, JC. Welcome in, John Edinger. Hey, John. John says, 16 days until my wife and I take my last Disney trip before I start treatment for my newly diagnosed cancer. Can't wait to get to Disney and forget reality. Absolutely, John. Oh, Hang John. In there. Yes, I mean, Disney, I mean, my philosophy of life is Disney cures all, right? <laughs> there you go. But um, we're very glad to hear that you and your wife are going to be coming to enjoy Disney um, before the treatment begins. And we hope and wish you well that Absolutely. you're, you know, you got this. You're going to beat this, John. Big thing is just keep fighting. Exactly. 
Welcome in, Megan G. Great to see you. Hey, Megan. Hope the uh, choreographing is going excellent. All Should right, we go let's right get... over here? I was hoping the, the fan spot is like maybe yeah. we... just right next I to think the fan. Right too? Next to the fan. Yeah. Maybe we can move towards the fan later. <laughs> <laughs> Alrighty. Sabrina B, welcome in. Hey, Sabrina. Sabrina says, hey guys, how hot is it today? Oh, uh, it's hot. It's very hot. <laughs> Especially in the sun. But in the show, it's, it's not like super terrible today. Yeah, it's really not that bad. The humidity levels are low, thankfully. So. Yeah. Welcome in, Terry Kessler. Hey, Terry. So from right here, guys, we'll be able to see the cavalcade coming from right down here. Uh, they come in about five minutes. In the meantime, straight across from us, you can see the Haunted Mansion. That's pretty cool. Exactly, John. You got this. So what you do is just say, we prefer to have you as well. Oh, Adam up. You don't like Wendell? <laughs> Wendell's adorable. Oh, poor Wendell. Now I it's, love all the country bears. It's Liver Lips McGraw that'll, that'll uh, have you <laughs> wondering some things. <laughs> Do yeah, you, want to, you uh, want to stand like here? If you want to. Just sort of like a little undercover? Gotcha. So where we're standing now is currently like the DVC area. If you are interested in DVC, this is the area you can come and ask about it. Absolutely. And from this perspective again, you can see the Haunted Mansion. You can see, oh goodness, uh, the Hall of Presidents down there. Oh, I think that's Ron's friend from yesterday. <laughs> oh, yeah. And down back this way. I have a pole in my way, so I will need to scoot that forward some. Watch out with the wheelchair. Gotcha. Down back this way is, uh, well, behind the tree is a splash mountain. And guys, the Vamos Cavalcade, the uh, Adventure Friends Cavalcade, begins in just about three minutes. And welcome in, Joe Nardo. Hey, Joe. Oh, Bowser says coffee? <laughs> Question mark. Coffee is always a yes from me, but uh, in terms of purchasing coffee, maybe not anytime soon, just because it's very, very hot. Yeah. And coffee dehydrates. It we does. need to hydrate. Uh, Richard Taylor says, can you say hi to my son, Liam Taylor? We love Disney World. For sure, Richard. Hello, Hel Liam Taylor. Hello, Liam Taylor. Welcome in, guys. Welcome in. Welcome Eric's exciting in. excursions. Welcome in. Welcome in, Eric. Oh, iced coffee. <laughs> well, that's still with dehydrate, even though it would be cold. Because <laughs> well, the caffeine in the coffee is like a dehydrator. Right. Uh, well, but um, that well, does sound good. Right. Welcome in, Gail. <laughs> Hey Gail, welcome in. Sorry, you get me talking about coffee, I won't stop talking. I love coffee. I know, it's all good. I'm like, coffee, yes. I could talk about that all day. Dole Whip Every Dave. Day. Dole Whip Dave says, sounds like you need a Dole Whip. Oh, said. speaking of things I can talk about a lot, or enjoy, Dole Whips, yes, those are good. Welcome in, Dole Whip Dave. Welcome in, Lakin's Adventures. Hey, Lakin, welcome in. Adam Up says, isn't coffee mostly water, though? Not Afternoon, if you order it like treat. we order it. <laughs> well, that's fair. Mostly espresso. Mostly espresso the way we order it. Welcome in Brandykins. Hey Brandykins. Good afternoon, evening. Yes, it is currently 5.08 here at, in Orlando. Yep. About one minute left before we will... Uh, I got a notification that the phone wasn't charging, but it looks like it is, so interesting. Maybe it's like the heat, you know? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Gary, yes, espresso is great. Completely agreed. Paul Freed, welcome in from welcome Pennsylvania. In Love Disney. Yes, thank you so much for joining us, Paul Freed. Great to see you again. And yes, thank you so much, Dolph Dave. We're feeling much better. We just wanted to exercise in abundance of caution before we came back to the parks so that we didn't uh, share anything that was shared with us. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> All right, I see cast members already starting to do oh, FPS. There uh -oh. we go. I think we're back. All right. But yes, like Monica just said, uh, Heavy Metal Crone said, you know it's hot when the cameras rebel. Exactly. Hi. We are the Park Hoppers. We know Ron was over here bothering you guys the other day. 
<laughs> run on the go. <laughs> but we're the park hoppers. Just park yes, sir. Hoppers. Park hoppers. Yeah, we've got the uh, Adventure Friends Cavalcade yeah, coming in uh, a minute or so. <laughs> exactly. Awesome. Unless you're in California. And then there's the uh, the hoedown that happens at 5. But we have right? not gone to California yet. Thank you. Yeah, that'll be, we uh, want to. It's on the list. Closer to Country Bear? We have a very long list. Gotcha. We'll make our way down it's that the way. Best park. Thank you. We're being told currently DCA is the best park in the whole Disney world. Disney California Adventure. Yeah, I know most people say Tokyo is better, but no. Uh, DCA, hands down. Really? I mean, they've, they pumped a lot of money into it in the 90s to, to bring it back and like make it more exciting. I love the uh, the, the color, the fountains. World I can't remember. World of Color. World of Color. Yeah. I just want to go to Alani. Alani is very yeah. nice. We <laughs> were just talking about going there. I'm trying to go at the end of the year. Oh, at the end of the year? Fantastic. That's awesome. I haven't been there in like since 2020. This week in 2020, I was there. And then it all. Oh, oh, man. Wow. Yeah. It looks awesome. It does, yeah. I mean, just to wake up and see the ocean like that, like that's enough for me. It's like a Give Disney cruise. Give me a pina colada, <laughs> some tropical drink. There you go. Set. Have you done the Disney cruise? <laughs> Not yet. That's uh, awesome need to do on that. their list. <laughs> the Magic is my favorite ship. You gotta really? try that one. Over the dream or the fantasy? You're going on the fantasy? No, no, no. Oh, I, we I, wish. Okay. I'm, I'm just surprised that it's the uh, that was funny. the dream is uh, your favorite over the uh, fantasy or the uh, no, or no the, the, magic. the magic is your favorite over the dream yeah, or the magic. fantasy. I'd be even more surprised to learn that he opened the wish. Yeah, yeah. I opened the wish. The, the dream is very crazy. The magic. Oh, the magic. Sorry. The wish looks spectacular. It looks really confusing to get around. It is. Though. That it looks is. like the biggest issue. You know. um, yeah. Have you yeah. ever been to Vero Beach? It's we have not been to Vero Beach. List? We have a long list. Y'all are local, right? We are local. Yeah. We live in Orlando. It's only an hour and a half. It is. Oh, wow. It is. Yeah, uh, it's really I think we've driven by that area a number of times, but uh, yeah, we've yeah. yet to stop in and, and like, check turtles, it out. Like, Hilton that would be Head awesome. as well is another nice one. Up in uh, South Carolina? Yeah. yeah. It's honestly not too oh far from here. It's only a couple yeah. hours. Yeah, because they have yeah, programs. What's nice really about like Orlando is you're five or six hours from the Keys. You're five or six hours from South Carolina, North Carolina area. Everywhere. Yeah. And if you're like me from New York, everything takes half time. Thank you. Oh my gosh. Yeah. Just watching little turtles like crawl to the ocean. Oh, man. So I, I guess oh. you don't really mind the traffic right now compared to New York. I, I don't hit any traffic. I live in Celebration. So oh, it's just a quick. Just hop on, get on the highway, and get over here. Uh, World Drive. World Drive. World yeah. Drive right on up. Once spring break season's over, it'll be nice to be. It will be. <laughs> See, I'm happy. I forgot what traffic is. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, that's that's one of the benefits of that area for sure. Yeah. Hi. Okay, I'm not seeing anything. I was like, I swear. Oh, Lakin said Alani was amazing. When I went, haven't been there in six to seven years though. I miss it very much. Oh man. Goodness, we have not been, but it's on our list. We have a, we have a very long list, guys. Absolutely. We're we're gonna have. We intend to be doing this for a very long time. Exactly. And there's a lot of things to in do in that, that long of duration of time of <laughs> live streaming and doing YouTube. Yes. Oh, Walt is leaving? I didn't see. Walt says, gotta get to a ball game. Have a great stream, Park Hoppers. Thank you so much, Walt. Have an awesome time at the ball game. Enjoy the game, Walt. Thank you so much for being here. John Edinger says, we set sail on the Fantasy in six. The right, maybe to I think hop. I'll need to, because I think it's the pole. Gotcha. If I'm not mistaken there. All right, we should be back, everybody. Sorry about that. Sorry about that, guys. And thank you so much, Greg. We appreciate that. Here comes the Adventure Friends Cavalcade, everybody. Amanda, just liked and subscribed. Thank you so much, Amanda. Thank you, Amanda. Welcome in, Andon. I hope I said that right. Hey, Andon. Get a zoom on that. Oh, Andon has an adorable picture of a little doggy. Oh. So cute. Oh, Megan, maybe at the end of summertime, maybe Murray might be back. <laughs> <laughs> Distrike says, Park Hoppers, I need a great hat to wear with my Run on the Go shirt. So any ETA when we can expect any merchandise from you. <laughs> we're, we're, we're starting to look into it. We are starting to. Thank you, Distrike. Oh, it's like working on it just right here. We are working on it. 
Both of those things are very possible, James. And thank you so much, Ryan. Oh, a lot of wind all of a sudden. Well, does it want to rain? Hopefully not. I don't know why the uh, Kimball is kind of doing its thing there. I do think that's the best cavalcade in yeah. Walt Disney World right now. I, I think I think um, when I was in Caballero saw my shirt with Donald. Oh, did they? Yes. <laughs> that's awesome. Let's make our way over to uh, Country Bears because oh, yeah, that's where the uh, hoedown is going to be Let's in go. three minutes. All right, time for the hoedown. Let's go. Right. Thank, Thank you. Thank you. All right, guys. All right. Where is a good spot for the hoedown? We have no idea. <laughs> Every time I hear hoedown, for some reason, uh, I think it's because uh, Neil was playing Muppets earlier. Oh, I, I Andy hear, heard me. Down. <laughs> <laughs> Andy and Bex, Three Musketeers, State Park Offers, I need to see Monica's shirt. <laughs> they don't miss a thing when it comes to Donald, do they? They don't. We will definitely show you guys my shirt here as soon as we get situated. Yep, I think this is a good spot. What do you think? Yeah, I think it's great. All right. Oh, very, very cool style. What's that? I like his style. Oh, yeah. All right. All right, so we got to show Andy and Bex the shirt. And OK. Then, whenever you're ready. You ready? Yeah. Oh, that way? OK. Oh, I was thinking so. OK, guys, I'll step back. There we Here's go. The shirt. So yeah, I think the... Uh, Three Caballero, very soft, Donald. I think so. That was awesome. Hello, guys. Hello, everybody. Oh. And in case you're joining us. Yeah, for the we, first time. For the first time. We are the Park Hoppers. We are. I'm Monica. And I'm Eric. This is Eric. <laughs> and we're Park Hoppers. So uh, please, guys, if you haven't already, click, tap, bop, hammer, that like button, the thumbs up one. That'd be awesome. And consider subscribing to our channel if you haven't yet already. That'd be yep. awesome. Thank you so much for the support, guys. Um, Thank you, everyone. We're going to turn the camera around and hopefully enjoy a hoedown. Yeah. What time is the hoedown supposed to happen? It's supposed to happen at 5.20. Which oh, is in one minute. One minute. Yep. Okay, we're going to turn it around so we don't miss a thing. <laughs> Greg says, Monica, like the shirt. Eric, like your hat. Well, <laughs> thank you, Greg. Thank you. Thank you, Megan. <laughs> if you see bubbles, Eric is near. <laughs> Welcome in, Jeannie. Hey, Jeannie. Oh, hey, thank John's you so much, home. Megan. Oh, thank you, Andy and Bex. They're like, oh my god, Donald, love it. <laughs> <laughs> they don't miss anything, Donald. No. It's awesome. Welcome in, John Serpum. 
Which one is the dancing hold down? This one. Add them up. Uh, you'll see all the country bears. You're saying see... which one of us is going to be dancing? Oh, oh, we'll dance behind the scenes. <laughs> yeah. Um, we don't exactly know how to hold down, but uh, we'll watch because this will be our first time enjoying the hold down. Right. And see what happens. Welcome in, Gabriella. Hey, Gabriella. Yeah, we definitely are um, talking about a bucket hat for our merch, for sure. For we love sure. bucket hats. <laughs> I hope the hoedown's gonna happen. It should happen here within the next minute or so. <laughs> Heavy metal crown says, scary Donald's shirt, but you wear it well. <laughs> Thank you. Marty M says, the cartoon with Donald Duck and the gorilla is very funny. Yeah, most Disney cartoons are pretty darn hysterical. We love them. All right, they just did last call on that showing of the Country Bear Jamboree, so I think we're about to get the hoe down. Oh, thank you so much, Bex and Andy. Three Musketeers say some special shirts are currently winging their way to you, Park Hoppers. Oh, thank you, guys. <laughs> thank you, guys, very much. We appreciate that. Oh, don't whip Dave. It's not that hard. Just put your right foot in, your right foot out. <laughs> and what? Shake it all about. <laughs> oh wait, that's the hokey pokey. That is the hokey Oh, is that the hoedown? They do do the hokey pokey, yeah. And the hokey pokey is the hoedown? Yep. Well, oh, not okay. at first, but like when they invite people to come and join oh, them, they do the hokey pokey because gotcha, most cause, like, people know the hokey I'm like, that, that intense dancing looked like way more intense. Yes. Well, yes. that's because that's square dancing. Right. 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 Okay. <laughs> we're, we're new to this, guys. We're new to this whole hoedown stuff. Huh. Well, Neil starts playing again in about eight minutes. Yeah, as soon as we finish enjoying the hoedown here, we'll head back over to Neil. Yep. Enjoy a bit more of the piano. <gasps> Tim Rimple is here. Welcome in, Tim. Hey, Tim. Good to see you, sir. Uh, Ron on the go says, look left. All right. Looking left, Ron. I don't know. That's left. <laughs> Half expected Ron to hop out there. Yeah, Ron's going <laughs> to pop out. Maybe. Hey, um, good to see you. I already said hi to M. I'm sorry, I, I don't know if I said hi. Oh, gotcha. <laughs> oh, Ron right on the guy says you should see a group of cast members. Gotcha. Not seeing them just yet. I'm starting to wonder whether or not they've canceled today. I sure hope they haven't canceled. This will be our first time watching the hoedown. Oh my gosh, are you? <laughs> I mean, there's a lot of people hanging out waiting for There is a lot of people, so I mean, that's a positive sign. I'm not seeing a lot of cast members gathered together, though. The cavalcade was four minutes behind, that is true. Yeah, out here in the heat, everything's just a little bit slower, a little bit behind uh, <laughs> compared to what it normally is. It is very warm. Yes. It is. Very hot today. I'm very thankful for the cloud coverage right now, though. Agreed. Welcome in, JG. Hey, hey. JG. Welcome in, the mayor. Hey, the mayor. Good to see you. The mayor says, just driving by to say hi. Safe travels, the mayor. Absolutely. Be safe, the mayor. Tim Rimple says, just start dancing. Maybe others will join. <laughs> I don't know about that, Tim. They might be like, those two look like crazy people. <laughs> well, whenever the hoedown starts. Yeah, that's it ends and that's fair. It could have just been pushed to 530. Oh, totally here we go. <gasps> There's Chip, oh my gosh, as a cowboy. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Where's Nikki and Kawaii? There's Chip and Dale.
right, guys, so All that right. was the hoedown. All let's, right, so uh, off to Neil. Let's go and catch Neil. Yeah. Do you want to go straight across this way and that then? Makes sense to me. Yep. Sounds good. All right, guys, let's head back this way. Sorry about that. All right. Tyler, yeah, still has some moves for sure. Yeah, he certainly does. Bex and Henry are like, we still want to do that when we come over, for sure. <laughs> <laughs> Gary's like, I'm tired just watching. Welcome in, Mark Howard. Hey, Mark Howard. Welcome in, everybody. Everybody that's joined us, thank you so much for being here. Welcome in, Ninja Watchers. That was the uh, hoedown, guys, over by Frontierland. We're currently crossing over into Adventureland and making our way over to Casey's Corner to enjoy Neil. Yep, exactly. Don't even think about it, Mr. Camel. Oh no, not the camel. Granted, it might be a little refreshing. It might be. I don't think the camel is spitting right now. I don't know, the water's pretty wet. Or the water's pretty wet. Good job, Eric, the water's wet. The ground is pretty wet. All right, guys, let's make our way over to Casey's Corner for Neil's final set of the day. And then, uh, what are you thinking? Maybe the train afterwards? So we, we, yeah, the train, right? The train, yes. Yeah, after Neil, we'll go and get on the railroad. Take the train all around the Magic Kingdom. And then enjoy the final cavalcade of the day. Sounds the Vamos cavalcade. The Adventure Friends cavalcade as it comes down Main Street one last time for the day. I think it might actually have been busier this way than it was going back towards... Uh, I, I thought it would be... Yeah. I don't know. I thought it would be less crowded this way. I get you. And closer to Casey's. Yeah. Well, it definitely is closer. And we got to see some things we didn't get to see before, so that's good. I like seeing different things. That's true. Yeah, the Sunshine Tree Terrace, the line is packed. Oh, yeah. And it's very hot, so folks want to get that ice cream. The dough whips and the lava float, lava floats and the, all those things. Yeah, the I lava you float? I lava you float, right. All right, guys, we're almost there, just a little bit further. Almost there. Heading towards Crystal Palace.
so that is Neil. Once again, that was his last set of the day. Uh, that occurs at 5.30 here at Casey's Corner. He is always, always an amazing entertainer. Inter entertainer, entertainer, guys. I can speak. <laughs> and pianist and a lovely person as yeah. well. Very sweet guy, guys. He takes the time to talk to guests and everything. so kind. He is. So if you haven't already checked him out, uh, we have a couple links for his YouTube uh, that have been in the chat a couple times here. Yeah, I don't know if, if one of our mods would uh, put Neil's YouTube channel in the chat, that would be awesome. He Just is, so everybody knows where to go to check him out. Absolutely. He is at Neil Piano. We really yes. appreciate that, guys. We're going to go ahead and get set up for the train now. Yes, Let's go we're going to head down Main Street to check out the train. Yep. I think she's asking him, where do you where do you get the music from? <laughs> and I think Neil's like, it's in my brain. <laughs> That's awesome. That is awesome. Welcome in, Mickey MX. Hey, Mickey MX. Okay, but really, where do you hide the music? No. Oh, Thank man. you so much, JJ, That's all Mickey. <laughs> That's all it's in there. <laughs> I feel that. Thank you so much, Neil. A few recipes. A few recipes? A few recipes? Yeah. Oh, man. Any good? Yeah? <laughs> you guys done for the day? Oh, oh no. no. We're, We're going to go. go on the railroad now. Yep. And then we are going to enjoy the cavalcade, the, friend, the friend's cavalcade, the, Vamos. Yep. And then we're going to park up back to Epcot and end the evening over there. With harmonies. Yeah. Yeah, Kelly's playing over there tonight. Oh, oh, yeah? yeah. Is, is that your nice. friend that was uh, performing the first night of uh, the Garden Rocks concert series, or? He might have. He, he has his hands in a lot of uh, different pianos, so it's gotcha. good to keep up with everybody's different stuff. But, uh, well, that's awesome. Really um, are you yeah. done for the day then? I'm done. That's awesome. And the 245 plus people we have in chat <laughs> are just saying how amazing you are and how lovely you are, and yes. Thank you yes. so much for coming. I appreciate it. <laughs> Thank you, Neil. Thank you so much, Neil. You guys have a good night. You, you too. too. Yeah. Thank you yeah. so much, sir. Sounds tiring just to Yes. <laughs> we'll see you Friday, hopefully. Yes. Oh, okay. Well, Friday? Uh, well, Friday, Wednesday? Friday? Oh, no, I'm off Friday. Friday, he's, yeah. Oh, no, yeah. we won't see him Friday. So, um, tomorrow we'll be at uh, Epcot. We might catch him over at the Rose and Crown if we're oh, there early. Rose and Crown, Epcot tomorrow. Yeah, yeah we're we'll early at 1.30. Wow. we got to be really early. That would be like the earliest stream we've ever done. Right? Maybe. 130, 230, 4, 5, 6, and 7. Yeah. Okay. We uh, almost yeah. named ourselves the Walt Disney World Vampires just because we only used to come we out after dark. We only used to go out at nighttime, <laughs> but now we're going on the daytime. So. And we're like, why? <laughs> Well, it's because Neil performs. It's because of Neil. Yeah, it's because of Neil. Exactly. You can't get Neil after dark. <laughs> Thank you so much, sir. Thank you. Thank you very much. Thanks for coming. You guys did your dance today? You guys did your dance today? Choir. Choir. Okay, cool. That's awesome. Have a great day. Always a pleasure, Neil. Thank you. Yeah, Neil has uh, Neil was a marching band member, so and it did look like um, that guest shirt was from marching band, but it was from well, choir. Yeah, it was a D23 uh, shirt. He's uh, a part of the D23 uh, musical acts that have been uh, walking around today. I guess he's a part of uh, the choir, which is really cool. Yeah. Exactly, X663. Neil's awesome. He really is. An amazing person, amazing pianist, like so talented. <laughs> M says, this is why we're friends. We're both fatty. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that is fair. Boy, Kitty says, all the cool bats hang out over at Pirates at dusk. <laughs> You'll also see them quite a bit over oh, in Fantasyland, too. And near the castle, yep. yeah. We see them quite often. And we thank them often because they do a great job of keeping things, you know, less mosquito-y. Yep. They are a wonderful uh, natural pest control. Yeah. Balloons. Who doesn't love Disney balloons? All right, we are making our way to the railroad, guys. And a uh, recent change that occurred, the railroad no longer closes at 6 p.m. It now closes, I believe, at 7 p.m., which is very good. Yeah, but we still want to get back in time for the uh, 625 cavalcade. Exactly. Oh, that little kid was playing with the fan and the misting one. It yeah. felt very nice oh, good. as I passed by. <laughs> It is a hot day, Mark Howard. It absolutely is. 
it's uh, it's impressive how uh, quickly that changed because we had some pretty cool nights recently. We'll miss those. We will. Oh, right. Sorry. <laughs> I went a twisty turvy kind of way. Oh, that breeze feels nice, though. That is a very nice breeze. Oh, someone called us an Uber. How nice, everybody. Thank you. <laughs> to take us all the way to Epcot after, oh, yeah. the, after the cavalcade? I don't know that that Uber would do that. <laughs> Heading on up, everybody. All right, everybody, let's take one look at the castle. Oh, absolutely, Paul. Sure of thing. Of course, Paul. Thank you for asking. Beautiful. Let's head over to the train. Sounds good, Heavy Metal Crone. Thank you so much for being here. I had to take a quick picture. So pretty. I get you. Wrong way there. Enjoy your dinner, Heavy Metal Crone. Absolutely. All ready, guys. Oh, look, the monorails are going to cross. Talk about timing. That was cool. That was really cool. That was monorail teal and monorail black crossing pass. It sure was. We got the two, uh... goodness gracious, what are we? Yes, ma'am, we are live, live on YouTube. On YouTube. Mm -hmm. <laughs> We've got the, uh, the two boats. I can never remember the, not river boats, but the uh, ferry, boats, ferry boats. Ferry boats crossing right now. Yeah. yeah. Oh, our channel is, uh, we're the park hoppers? Mm -hmm. That's us. Did I close? Oh. No, I just went black on it. Oh yeah, it's probably because it's like, it's very hot. Gosh. Yeah, that's us. Oh, thank you so much, guys. Oh, well, that's really awesome, Paul. Oh my god, I totally did Paul, uh, Chicago Fire on NBC is going to be uh, airing tomorrow night, and the prop he made is part of the story. It's oh, a surprise, wow. but you'll see it. It's red and silver and the size of a loaf of bread. That's awesome, Paul. That is awesome. That's Chicago Fire at NBC. That's really cool. Thank you so much for sharing that with us, Paul. Thank you, Paul. Oh. 200 likes. Thank you so much, everybody. We really Thank you appreciate guys. that. Welcome in, Simon Rogers. Hey, Welcome Simon. in, Lodz Cooper. Hey, Lodz. Thank you guys so much for joining us. We are currently waiting to get on the railway. Yep. Well, on the railroad. <laughs> the ferries look beautiful. Aren't like they? with the sun mm -hmm. on them. Very pretty. Yeah, it seems, mm -hmm. it seems really, really strange to say this as we're like just dying in this heat. But it is very hot. Stay warm, Kirsty. Oh, stay warm? <laughs> we'll send some warmth your way, Kirsty. Yeah, subscribe to all through Well, thank you so much. Thank you guys. Oh, um, Christy was saying we shall be there three weeks today. That's awesome. Three weeks. Oh, and Christy's doing the after hours thing too. Ah. You think the 50th will be off the castle on Saturday? 
I don't think they're selling the castle, the chef manager. Unless you mean the... The, the 50th logo on the castle, the emblem. Oh, that's a good question. I'm not sure how fast they're going to go about it. I think it'll come off Sunday night. You think? I think so. Uh, it would make sense that it would be off for Saturday because the end of the month is the end of the 50th anniversary celebration. But I think they'll make all of the changes last minute when they stop enchantment and they start Happily Ever After. I, I would be willing to, to bet on that, you know? Yeah. Gosh, it is, even in the shade now, it's like so warm. <laughs> it is. <laughs> I miss the cold now. I complained about the cold too much last week that one day it was like windy. And now it's like, okay, you don't want the cold? Well, here's the hot. Yep, enjoy for it. It's hot? Oh my gosh. Snowing? Oh my gosh. Did you guys want to say hi on the stream? Sure. Okay. Well, let us know whenever you're ready and we'll, we'll put you on there. <laughs> If you guys want to, if you guys don't. It's up to you guys, or if you want to be on it. Okay. Okay. Are you ready? You ready? Okay. Turn around and they want to say hi. Say hi, everybody. Where are you guys from? Minnesota. Minnesota. Oh, explains why it's called oh. home. <laughs> Have you melted yet? Are you guys melting right now? Like uh, like Olaf running yeah. in the summertime? Yeah. Oh. yeah you put sunscreen, hydrating, all the good things. That's important. I never got to run sunburn at first, and then I started putting on sunscreen as soon as I got sunburned. Oh, but no. that's what's important. You just got to keep reapplying throughout the day until the sun is gone, and you'll be okay. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah we're from Orlando. Oh, well, we live in oh, Orlando, no. but we are. You from were 60, and you were complaining how hot it was. Oh, you. 60. So, what's your favorite ride that you've been on since you've been here? The roller coaster. The Seven Dwarfs. Tron. Seven Dwarfs. Yeah. Did you guys do Tron? Have you, no? Tron, the light cycle one over in Tomorrowland, the new Not one? Yet? Oh, yeah, right now they're doing a soft opening, so you get the chance to get on the virtual queue, but you have to like sign up at 1 p.m. At, in the parks, and it's yeah. like, it's very like, it's a gamble. <laughs> but Seven Dwarves is a lot of fun. We love Seven Dwarves. Yeah. Did you guys, yeah, the, the wage is crazy. Exactly. Everybody's saying hello, Minnesota. <laughs> <laughs> hello, Minnesota. Don't say hello. We honestly don't want to. We don't want to stay here. Well, thank you guys so much for saying hi. Thank, thank you. you. Thank you. Okay, I have that video as soon as possible. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, man, I wish it was like 60. Oh, that would yeah. be nice. That would be beautiful. That would be really nice. They're probably going to want us to move up in a little bit. Yeah. I'll show you my screenshot. She's going to kill you. Hi. How are you doing, Susan? Welcome in, John. Hey, John. <laughs> Paul's like, it's raining and snowing again all over. Oh, no in California today. Oh no. It sounds nice, the snow part though. The rain sounds nice The rain, not tonight. <laughs> what was he asking? Oh no, they're just uh, communicating on who might get on the next train and who Oh, might. gotcha. Yeah. Oh, Simon Rogers says, my sister lives in Minnesota. And then a cold face emoji. <laughs> well, hopefully she's staying warm, Simon. Welcome in, Mary. Hey, Mary. Hey, Plymouth Rock. Yes, we are waiting for the train. We're turning park hoppers into a weather channel. Well, <laughs> hey. it's, it's hot. We could do both. And up in Minnesota, it apparently is cold. Yes, <laughs> which makes a lot of sense geographically. It does. All right, guys, here comes a train. It certainly might be the Royal Disney. That's a good, uh, good call there. That's right. Sounds good, Lex and Andy. Thank you so much. Now, it all depends on how many people get off this train, whether or not they'll be getting on the Royal Disney. Yeah. Car 3 is the outlaw car. What's up? There is a lot of 
empty seats, so... There are. There's a lot of people in front of us still, though. That's true. If we don't get on this one, we'll get on the next. Exactly. Bless you. Sorry about that, Anna. You're fine. Welcome in, Shannon. Hey, Shannon. Good to see you. We're melting out here in the heat. Shannon, how are you today? But always a good day at Disney, though. So I must say that. <laughs> Well, let's see what we can find. We want car three, right? <laughs> car three, if we can. There's room. Okay, guys. Yeah. Okay. After you. Sorry about the glare, everybody. Just a moment. All right. You got it? Yep. Thank you. There we are. We are aboard the Royal Disney, everybody. Barely, but we made it. <laughs> we made it on. It is a Scorcha, absolutely, Anthony the Mullen Man. So a little bit more boarding, and then we'll be on our way. Is Ron still in here? I think Ron is. Shouldn't he be getting ready for his stream tonight? Well, he has like two hours. Oh, that's true. Those two and hours Ron, disappear fast. And Ron is fast. He is fast, that is true. Welcome in, Speeding Staying 38. Good afternoon. Hey, Speeding Stag. Welcome in. Thank you guys so much for joining us and of course um, if you've been on the railroad with us before as soon as it starts going we are going to be quiet so you guys can enjoy the narration and um, we'll talk again at the next um, stop. Exactly. <laughs> Shannon. Go ahead. <laughs> Shannon says, uh, so you're melting today. It's 50 here and I'm thinking heat wave. Oh my goodness, I wish it was 50 here, Shannon. That sounds so nice. So we'll trade you 20 degrees here for 20 <laughs> degrees there. So you can be 70 there and it can be 70 here. We'd be cool with that. Yeah, is that how it's going to work? <laughs> Temperature trade off? Temperature trade. Temperature trade. Just cut a little off the top uh, here and just pack it on over there. Oh my goodness. All right, I think they closed off the uh, boarding. Are we good? Oh, right here? Yeah. <laughs> Mark Howard, we need all the trade in the UK. <laughs> and then Shannon's like, too much math for me, but whatever you want. <laughs> well, thank you, Shannon. Eric's, Mary Eric's good with the math. Welcome in Ear to Ear Magic. You're absolutely right, Chris. It was 93 degrees as high today. Oh my gosh, Chris, welcome in. Days. Yeah, it's been very warm today. The feel like temperature when we first left uh, the house was what, like 102 or something? Yeah, it should be a lot better tomorrow though. It hopefully, be. hopefully that's an uh, accurate temperature forecasting uh, there. Yeah, last I saw it should be a high of 80, I think. Yeah. Which would just be a tremendous difference. Yeah, tomorrow would be very nice. Will be very nice, hopefully. Okay. All right, I think we might be heading off. Soonish, anyways. Yep, welcome in the JAZ vlog. Hey, the J vlog, welcome in. Hey, Rich J. Welcome in, Rich J. Great to see you guys. And guys, again, like Monica said, once the train starts moving, we will be quiet just so you guys can enjoy the trip around. Uh, I almost said the Walt Disney World. Magic, Magic Kingdom. Kingdom. <laughs> oh, Mary's enjoying um, the live stream with Adam and Blake. We're two cats. That's awesome. I'll that say hello awesome. to Adam and Blake from us. From us. <laughs> yeah. Welcome in, John the Barber. Hey, John the Barber. And guys, for those of you who are new here or don't know, uh, we are Monica and Eric for the Park Hoppers. 
We go live from the park several times per week. We'd love to take you guys along with us. Uh, please, if you haven't already, consider subscribing. It uh, would certainly help our channel. It also helps you to find us again in the future if you'd like to. And if you ring that notification bell and make sure it's uh, set to all, it'll alert you every time we go live. It certainly will. And if you haven't already, please consider bopping that like button. Once again, always, always, always uh, appreciate all the support, everybody. Thank you so much. Here we go. We are about to leave Main Street Station. And welcome in World's Greatest Dude 1. Hey, World's Greatest Dude 1. We're enjoying Magic Kingdom right now, and then we'll be uh, park hopping over to Epcot later this evening. Yep. And we may have some surprises in the near future, so, you know, hang in there. Yeah. Enjoy the train, guys. Welcome aboard, folks. We're beginning a grand circle tour of the Magic Kingdom. It stops along the way in Frontierland and Fantasyland. Sit tight and keep your hands, arms, feet, and legs well inside the train. We're currently departing Main Street Station. And if you're missing those friendly faces already, not to worry. On this train, it's never goodbye. It's always see you real soon. Para su seguridad, permanezca sentado y mantenga las manos, brazos, pies y piernas dentro del tren. Y cuide a los pequeños. Gracias. Friends, I'm so delighted you joined us today. There's nothing I enjoy more than showing folks around this magic kingdom. Especially because it's certified proof that in these parts, dreams really do come true. With a balloon in my hand and a wish in my heart that someday I'd be the conductor of this train. And wouldn't you know it, with a bit of gumption and a dash of magic, here I am. So believe it when I say that around here, anything is possible. See what I mean? Hope you packed a comfort because that is the sound of adventure. Uh, adventure land. I should say. Whether navigating wild jungle rivers, swashbuckling with jolly buccaneers, or even just scaling a towering tree, always Frontierland Station now. Hmm. Always like to take a look at the Splash Mountain progress that we have going on here. Tiana's uh, Adventure Bunny. Tiana's Bayou Adventure. I don't know why I always have trouble remembering the order of that one, but working right along there. We have not tried the food over there just yet, World's Greatest Dude 1. Uh, we do intend to uh, try some things eventually. Uh, it does look a little strange, but you know, who knows? It could be pretty good. And that's an try the awesome, food where? Uh, over by uh, Tron. Oh, Tron, yeah. 
Um, the food doesn't, well, I don't know. It looks interesting. It looks interesting. It looks different. Um, not your typical park fair, quick service food. That is Which true. is not a bad thing. No. Um, we might try it one day. Are yeah. you guys interested in seeing the food over there at all? <laughs> Paul also said the Royal Disney locomotive number four, specifications built in February of 1916, originally for United Railways of Yucatan. It's 51,000 pounds, 46 uh, and has 46 inch drivers, 160 pounds of pressure. For Walt Disney's Railroad Story, page 394. Wow, that's right? awesome. Thank you so much, Paul. Thank you, Paul. Hey, welcome in, Lori. Hey, Lori. <laughs> Shannon. What did Shannon say? Shannon's like, JJ, I don't know what to say. I'm honored. Wish my wife thought the same thing, but I'm like number 34 or something. 34? Oh, that's doing pretty good, Shannon. Because uh, JJ Mickey was saying to Shannon, you're number one in my book. Aww. Star. <laughs> JB Basson says, I think I'm going to get a one day park hopper ticket for my dad and take him on Guardians and Sean and me. Random thoughts from the McDonald's drive through <laughs> Those are great thoughts from the McDonald's drive through Those are awesome thoughts. Go. But yeah, like Tron and Guardians, so much fun. Yeah. You sure? Yeah. Okay. There we go. You guys have more room now, but oh, thank you. <laughs> no problem. Yeah, it is strange not seeing a line down there, though. It is. Welcome in, Jeffrey. Hey, Jeffrey. Won't be too much longer, everybody, before we are off and on our way to... Stumpy? Stumpy. <laughs> Fantasy Fantasy Land Station. Station. Are your table's ready, Freddy, too. It does seem like that, right? To Metro Twigs, welcome in. Welcome in. Thank and you so thank much you. for joining us. On our way over to Fantasyland Station, guys, we do tend to lose a little bit of signal underneath uh, one of the overpasses. Uh, welcome yeah. up, hang in there. If you uh, encounter any lag, just go ahead and refresh and make sure that your live indicator is red. And you'll be back here with us as soon as we can get the signal back, which is usually rather quick, so. <laughs> Merrily on our way to nowhere in particular. Anyone guess the movie, Shannon says. Hmm. That's a good question. He might have a stump. <laughs> is that funny? That is funny. Okay. I thought it was funny. <laughs> Jeremy, he says Stumpy Land Station. Oh, Shannon said it's Mr. Toad. Oh, that makes sense. I I mean, I didn't, I wasn't thinking exactly Mr. Toad, but like I was in the Fantasyland like, thought process. Oh, yeah? So that's pretty good, right? That is pretty good. What is that noise? That's the uh, steam. Oh, yeah, we're Here off. we go, everybody. Okay, we're gonna be quiet to the next station. Enjoy, guys. Howdy, folks. If you're just joining us, a hearty welcome aboard. We're heading for our next stop, Fantasyland, before carrying on to Main Street, USA. Everybody stay seated and keep your hands and arms, feet and legs safely inside the train. And as always, keep an eye on your little ones. Para su seguridad, permanezca sentado y mantenga las manos, brazos, pies y piernas dentro del tren. Y cuide a los pequeños. Gracias. Those of you who've been riding with me for a spell already know how much I love minding this railroad. But for those times, I'm fixing for something a bit wilder. Big Thunder Mountain is the place. Is there? Wonderland. Isn't it something? 
Just think of the extraordinary things to see and do in these woods. Hiking trails, bird calls, fireflies, and starry nights. Setting out for adventure at sunrise and telling the tale around a campfire that night. Considering how wonderful things are out here, I'm fortunate that some of my closest friends call it home. That village is a really special place. Folks, we're just about out of the woods and into the forest. The enchanted forest of fantasy where magic Listen, hear that? Well, I think it's finally time I trained my shadow to stay put. <laughs> Told you it's enchanted, and not just the forest. From the tips of castle spires to the sands under the sea, magic and happily ever afters await around every person. to soar with Dumbo, or join Goofy in his stunt plane for some airborne acrobatics. This station is also your gateway to the rest of Fantasyland and Tomorrowland. Now, please wait until the train has come to a complete stop. Gather your juggling pins, unicycles, and other belongings, and carry your strollers away from the platform before unfolding them. That way, we can start loading up for the next leg of our trip. For those disembarked, please watch your step and thanks for traveling with us. I hope you join us again real soon. Hey! If you're staying, Hi folks, please continue to remain seated. Okay, we're all clear. You're good to go. Welcome All right, guys, to welcome to Fantasyland Station. Everybody say hello to Stumpy. Hi, Stumpy. I just realized how strange that looks because I'm like waving forward. Hi, Stumpy. There we go. <laughs> And once again, guys, as usual, if uh, there's anyone who's confused about this, uh, Ron on the Go, a fellow streamer here in Walt Disney World, recently did a, what was it, nine hour, 20 lap uh, trip around like uh, Magic Kingdom? Like an all day Kingdom? Saturday stream on the railroad, which yeah. was intense, insane, and awesome. Yeah. But yeah, along that journey, we made a friend called Stumpy. Yep. So, Every time we're here at Fantasyland Station, we say hello to Stumpy. Gotta say hi to Stumpy. So we're here at Fantasyland Station, everybody. It looks like the train is taking on a little bit of water. And just a quick reminder, because we did, uh, we always encounter some lag. Just make sure your live icon is red, guys, and your setting is set to 1080p. Yep. And if it's not, try refreshing. Exactly. Thank you, everybody. Thank you, Three Musketeers. We appreciate that. Thank you, guys. All right, guys. Now, the next leg of the journey, we're going to be heading through the tunnel, which is uh, the tunnel underneath Tron. Uh, we'll be trying to catch everything we can there, but again, we may lag as we go through the tunnel, so bear with us a little bit there. On the other side, we'll be heading towards Main Street Station. When we hit Main Street Station, we will be leaving the train station and heading down towards Main Street a little bit. Where we'll catch the final cavalcade of the night. Vamos. Vamos. The Adventure Friends cavalcade. <laughs> Shannon says, it's amazing the world we live in. There's a stump that's more popular than me. Not sure how I feel about that. Um, stumped. Oh. <laughs> and I wouldn't say that it's more popular than Not you, Shannon. Not more popular than you, Shannon. 
Anytime we see you in a chat, it brings a smile to our faces, and we know we're not alone with that, so. Yes, that's for sure. You may just not recognize your popularity. I appreciate the stump fun, though. <laughs> They're still popping in the tree. Yeah. They're certainly trying to. And just a reminder, of course, we do a 10 to the signal in the Tron, which is the tunnel by Tron, just in the beginning. Um, so if we do, just hang in there. Yep. Oh, welcome back, Andon. Hey, Andon. We're on the uh, train now. Yep. <laughs> At, uh, we're at the Fantasyland station currently, and we're headed to the Main Street station. Yep, exactly. We're, uh, we're going to be getting off and enjoying the Vamos Friendship Cavalcade. Yep. Hey, hey, Cassidy. Welcome in, Cassidy. Welcome back. Good to see you again. So everybody, when we hear the two toots from the train, which means it's time to go, we will uh, be saying goodbye to Stumpy and making our way towards Main Street station. And don't tell Shannon about the Lone Cypress. Alright guys, everybody say goodbye to Stumpy. Bye Stumpy. Well, thank you so much, Mary Carol. Thank you, Mary. And we do intend to end, and if we don't, we will be tomorrow, absolutely. Hey, Patty. Oh, no worries, Andon. We know you mean harmonious. <laughs> yep. Enjoy the train, guys. Looks like we're on our way, and I'm so glad to have you with us. The next leg of our journey takes us to Main Street, USA. We'll head for Frontierland after that. Stay seated and keep your hands and arms, feet and legs inside the train at all times. Gracias. Next up is a place that's always ahead of the curve. And not just because we're on a straightaway. <laughs> Our metropolis of mechanical marvels, Tomorrowland. Really something? As you know, I love this railroad about as much as a songbird loves And I'm still falling by the rocky feet of Unidentified users detected in upper contact area. Calculated. Locomotive maintaining trajectory. Intervention not required. Yeah, it looks like the uh, people mover is broken down. Oh, gimbal. Need to restart the gimbal. <laughs> and that's the secret that makes intergalactic travel possible. So simple what you hear it, right? <laughs> there we go. Yes, sir, in this yeah. place of boundless optimism, the possibilities are endless. You might say the sky's the limit, but even that is no obstacle in tomorrow land. Hi folks, just a friendly reminder to please continue to keep your hands warm, legs and feet all the way inside the tree. trip around the Magic Kingdom is almost complete. I can't thank you enough for spending part of your day with me. 
and I hope you've enjoyed your journey as much as I've appreciated being a part of it. We're now approaching our most charming destination, Main Street, USA, a place where the only thing sweeter than the townsfolk is the treats. After our stop, we'll be heading to Frontierland, followed by a visit to Fantasyland. For now, stay seated until our train comes to a complete stop. Then pick up your belongings and carefully disembark. If the next train is please take them all the way beyond the platform. Hi folks, one more reminder. Hands are like this means you still need to be inside the train, and it's a train, not a swing. We give our fellow travelers a friendly wave hello. This is Main Street Station, after all. Welcome to Main Street, USA. All right, folks, as we arrive into the station, once again, please continue to keep your hands, arms, legs, and feet inside the train. While it is still in motion, I will let you know when we have the alternative to spark the train. Until then, once again, please continue to remain seated. Thank you. Remain seated, the train is still in motion. We are now all clear to disembark. Welcome back to Main Street, USA. Alright, this all is right. our stop. This is our stop. Yeah, thank you. Oh, there we go. Thank you, have a good day, guys. Thank you, guys. Alrighty. You alright? Can you make up the... Oh, thank you. <laughs> Ron on the go, come on, car three, behave. Yeah, it's you the know, bad boy car, you know? It's the rebel car. It is. Yeah. Oh, we're um, live streaming on YouTube? Yeah, this is our channel if you guys want to follow. Yeah, we're the park hoppers. <laughs> Thank you. Alrighty, guys. I still love this glass roof. Alright guys, we are making our way to get a spot for the Friendship Cavalcade. The Ad Adventure, Adventure Friends, Friends Cavalcade. Cavalcade. Yep. That is the Vamos Cavalcade. Vamos. And then after we enjoy the Cavalcade, we'll be making our way over, well, back to Epcot. Yep. Yeah. Our copy back to Epcot. Stays in That's awesome. All right, where should we get a spot for the cavalcade? Uh, let's head a little bit over towards the Emporium. I think it's a good idea. <gasps> oh, I wanted to pop in the Emporium really quick. Do you think we have time? Yeah, we've got about uh, six or seven minutes before the cavalcade gets here. Should we pop in the Emporium before or after, do you think? That's up to you, honey. There's just a few new uh, things that were released. Gotcha. So I do wonder if they have them here at the, ca at the Emporium. Okay. Oh, thank you, Beaker and Honeydew. Thank you, guys. We appreciate that. <laughs> Disney MUK came in saying shopping. <laughs> yeah, there's some new merch, like some really cool new merch that I've seen. I just haven't seen it in person yet. Gotcha. Yeah, let's see what we can find. Yeah. We should be able to hear the cavalcade coming Look, long they before it's here. Coming. What? what? Look at this beautiful Munchlings display oh, right here no. for me. Okay, and on second thought, maybe we should just go catch the, the cavalcade and not worry about the store. <laughs> That's beautiful. They're like, Mom, look, coming. Munchlings. Adam Up says, it's a trap, Eric. It is a trap, right? <laughs> 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 oh my gosh, that's so funny. I know, This is like a brand new display here, and I'm like, we haven't been to the aquarium in quite some time. True. So it's like, Munchlings, my babies. Oh, look at this stitch. He's so cute. He is. Did you see the stitch to your left as well? Which? The Pride collection one. Oh, yeah. I don't think I've seen that one. Uh, we did, during Pride time. Oh, uh, 34 dollars Pretty neat. 
Oh, and there's the Eastern one still, too. Down. All the babies. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> I love the babies. Raja and Stitch. Oh, my gosh. How cute, right? That's the worst part, Shannon. If you can't reach the remote, you got to find somebody else to reach it for you. Chris B, we have showed the uh, flag retreat ceremony here at Disney quite a few times. Yep. Uh, we love it. It's it's a beautiful, beautiful ceremony. It is. And we'll definitely catch it again in the future. Yeah, it already happened today, though. Yeah, it's at 5 o'clock. What are these? Star Wars playing uh, cards. Yep, these are heavy. Cards. Well, it's three decks of playing cards. Well, it's heavy. I, $30. I so. Wow. These are fancy. Yeah, they are. I haven't seen those before. So that's new. That is. Oh no. Sounds happened? good, Paul. Uh, you know, take care of yourself, sir. Oh, hope you feel better, Paul. Thank you so much for joining us today. Absolutely. Hopefully we'll catch you later, Paul. If we don't, have a wonderful evening. I'm not seeing the new stuff. I thought I might see a bunch of the 100 stuff, Oswald. Well, there's a bunch of the 100 stuff to your love. Oh, you're saying that's what you're seeing? I'm only seeing the hundreds. Oh, okay. Yeah. Gotcha. I was looking for that, you know, the artist. Oh, yes. Okay, I know what you're talking it's about. It's here, now. it's here. <gasps> oh, my gosh. Yeah, it's Joey Chu. Like, he does, like, this beautiful, beautiful artwork. So they have things like this tumbler, this beach towel. I'm not sure what this is. This is a picnic blanket. Oh, neat. Oh, I'm sorry to bother you. Do you guys have the pin of this design? Um, if we had a pin, it would be, be in, in the, the pin very section. last room. Yeah. Gotcha. Thank you. So. Let's take care of yourself, Paul. We'll catch you back another time. Hopefully, uh, you get to feeling better, sir. Wow, this is heavy. $30. This is a really nice tray. It is. I like that a lot. Oh my gosh, look at sorry the picture. This is really nice. It is. And it has a lid. It does Not have all lid. pictures they sell at Disney have lids. That $34.99. Is cool. That's really nice. A lantern as well. We'll probably see a lot of this over at the Creation Shop as well. Probably. They have everything from bowls and plates, cups. Okay, see, like I saw these plates online um, on social media. But in person, they're like, they're saucer plates. They're yeah. not like a full-size plate. Yeah, those are pretty tiny. Good for like a, like bread service and stuff like that, but. That's why it's really good to see things in person if you can. Oh yeah. But the cups, I, I must have these. I must, I must. <laughs> what do you guys think? Isn't it cute? Like, I love all the designs. This artist is like, makes really really pretty stuff they do I went okay so do you think we have time to go see if they have the pin I don't no. Oh no we can check right well, after the cavalcade check after? if you want yeah okay we'll check after the cavalcade let's go get the cavalcade set up sounds good all right how much are the cups Patty wants to know I'm not sure we're not <laughs> what's that we're, we'll check out we'll check it out later okay we're like halfway away I'm sorry, I, th I thought you had said the price. Huh? I'm sorry, I thought you had said the price. I did not say the price, so I didn't get to find it. Oh, I'm sorry, honey. Well, we'll go back in. Yeah. They may be running a little bit late, but uh, right now would be about the time that they'd be hitting the hub and coming down this way. Okay, you want to go further down that way? Sure. Because that way when we get back in the store, we go straight to the pins. That's fair. Sure. Balloons. Yeah, and we'll check the uh, we'll check the price on the cup on our way out of the uh, emporium as we head back that way. Just remind us. Yep. I mean, we'll probably remember, but probably, just in but case. Yeah. I can hear the music. What? I can hear the music. Yeah. Um. Here's.
There's an empty spot right here if you want it. Right here? Or gotcha. do you want the trash can over there? Yeah, no, that's a good spot right here. Because we could do the trash can if you wanted. We could, but this is fine. That's funny because you can hear the music coming, but they haven't started to clear off the uh, Main Street just yet. Thank you so much, everybody, for spending your afternoon with us today. We are uh, about to enjoy the Adventure Friends Cavalcade. Uh, after that cavalcade is done, we'll head back into the store, take a look at a couple of things in there, then make our way over to uh, the monorail, which will take us back to the TTC, and then the monorail that'll take us back to Epcot, where we will continue our day at Epcot. Well, by then it's evening. <laughs> but yeah, definitely a Disney-filled day. Oh, yeah. Hey, welcome in, Michelle Camara. Hey, Michelle. Shannon Blankenship says, somebody asked me once if I'm a glass half full or a glass half empty kind of guy. I said I'm more of a half beer empty kind of guy. I don't know, Shannon, when you see that beer at only half of your cup, at that point, it's, it's starting to get a little sad because it's like, oh no, it's almost over. Can we move out to the middle? Uh, we cannot. Uh, well, I mean, we can, but, uh, but we're likely to lose the spot is all. Yeah, we just got to maintain the spot. Speaking of the spot, do you want to step a little bit more towards the side before you lose yeah. it? I get you. Shannon's like, see, Eric understands me. Oh, no, I'm... They come, everybody. Oh, no. And everybody, just make sure your live icon is red and your settings are set to 1080. And if they're not, try refreshing. Exactly. Oh, enjoy, John. It's interesting. There's so many people still in the middle of Main Street yeah, down there. Yeah, the cavalcade's quite a while away still. No, it's right there, though. Is it? Yeah. What happened? Did Joe just poke some uh, guests in the way, maybe? Yeah. How weird. Here they come. Little Ray Plus 2 just joined us. Oh, hey, Little Ray.
guys. So that's the Adventure Friends Cavalcade. Okay. Let's head into the store and see if they have that pin. Yeah, sounds good to me. Thank you. I just need the strollers behind me to... Yeah. Uh, you, if you can step out that way. There you go. Oh boy, all right. I just didn't want to go in front of this good. Oh, no, oh good. I get you. Uh, here is where the wall of ears is here in the Emporium. Yep, gotcha. Have a great night, Nick. Thank you so much. Good night, Nick. All right, I am on the hunt for that one pin. I don't know if they have it here or not, but if they do, it would be here. That's fair. So far, I'm not seeing it. There are a you lot of pins You seem to know there. where your stuff. <laughs> Have you seen this pin? Ooh, that's a part of our newer collection. Yeah. If we have it, I if I don't see it on this wall, it yeah. might be near the other parts of like the collection because we just got that. I, in, like, yeah, because we saw where the saw cups and there? stuff, and I, I asked about it the pin, and there? they told me over here. So. It wasn't over there. Okay. So. Not yet. Maybe. Um, <laughs> Because I've been trying to look around and I don't see it. And yeah, I, yeah, you really have to go like row <laughs> by row sometimes. Um, so we had it with the inside Right, that's what I figured. all this too. Yeah. And you would, it's vibrant, so it's like I you would know, see you it. would see it, exactly. So I'm like, you know, I hear you over here. I'm like, you know what you're talking about. <laughs> if we don't have it here, I would for sure check Town Square where you meet Mickey. Okay. Um, I would check there as well. Uh, do you also plan on making a trip to Disney Springs? Um, not in the near future, but... I was going to say, if you check World of Disney, they might have it there. Um, also, I've noticed, like, Hollywood Studios, they have an insane amount of, like, cool pins that we don't have. Yeah. So I would also check Hollywood Studios as well. Okay. Sounds like a plan. Thank you so much. Thank you. All right, guys. Let's head further into the... Oh, no, not the much links. Not the much things. Okay, all right. Munch nope, not the much things. <laughs> As he walks the other way. <laughs> yeah, she. I was like, she knows what she's talking about over there. Oh yeah. That's the Lion King Spirit jersey. It's oh. sold out like so fast in Disneyland. And the Stitch one. Oh my gosh, this one's selling out like hotcakes too. This is the brand new Lion King Spirit jersey. Like, they don't have it in Disneyland right now. It's sold out over there. Of course, oh, no. this one says Walt Disney World. Bicker and Honeydew said, first one is to spot the uh, Bicker and Honeydew pin uh, wins. So then, oops, they <laughs> walked away. <laughs> Sorry, guys. Wow, I really like yes, that. Yes, exactly, one. John. Yep, if we uh, really want to find that pin, we might have a pretty good shot over at Disney Springs. Yeah, that's a fair point, like she was saying. And here's the Stitch one. Oh, my gosh. Do we, like, need this in our lives? Uh, when it's a million degrees outside, no. I know, but it's so <laughs> beautiful, right? It is very cute. <laughs> I love the blue tie-dye and the stitch. Look at the stitch there. That's okay. hilarious. But yeah, this is like brand, brand new. Like, wow. That's an awesome spirit jersey. Yeah. There's no price on them, but they tend to run in the $85 range. Right. All right, and then we got to check the price on the cups on the way out for Patty. Yep. Sounds good. Patty's like, I like the Lion King jersey. And Megan's like, yes, you need it, buy it now. <laughs> <laughs> it's so pretty. Sounds good, Cassidy. Thank you so much for being here. Have a great evening. Thank you, Cassidy. All right, we're making our way back to the cups. I'm gonna <laughs> guess like 28. 
Well, okay, it's a set of four. Okay, I'm sticking, I'm gonna say 30. Yeah, I'm gonna say 35. I'm gonna say 30. Because they are plastic. <gasps> 35, you won. Oh my goodness, guys. He's learning too much. <laughs> All right, let's head out of here because it's getting quite busy. It is so, so patty 34 99 are those cups, Patty. 34 99 All right, guys, let's make our way over to Epcot. We gotta get to Epcot. Alrighty, guys. To the monorail. You want to step out on Main Street real quick and say goodbye to the uh, say good night to, Well, castle? good night to the castle, yeah. Oh, is it a good thing? Good night, castle. Good night, castle. We'll see you soon. Yeah. We'll be back in uh, Magic Kingdom. Friday? Friday, if we don't. Yeah, that's why I thought we were to see Neil, but I forgot Neil doesn't work on Fridays here. Right, that's Grayson. That's uh, Grayson. Neil will be uh, the pianist over in Rosencrown tomorrow. Yeah, we may catch him tomorrow. We'll see. He certainly might. And then uh, if we do anything on Thursday, we'll see, uh, we'll see how that goes as well. So for right now, this is us saying goodbye to Cinderella Castle and we're going to head over towards Epcot. Look at that sky. That's the pretty. sky is like, wow. And Megan said, yay, park hopping, the most annoying thing. Hey, it's our namesake. We've got to get it in there, right? That's beautiful. Oh no, Shannon. Shannon says, my son went on vacation and my wife's been out of town for three weeks. I'm so lonely. <laughs> well, you're here with us, Shannon. As long as you're here, you're not alone. All right, let's head over to Epcot. Let's do it. <laughs> People say very strange things in the parks. Oh no, what did they say? Oh, that was a negative thing. Oh, gotcha. I don't know what about though. As I inhaled like a lot of their cologne in my mouth, I was like, oh, yeah, tasty. I was like, oh, well, I don't like your colognes. Eh? Oh, <laughs> 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 little Rufus too says, you said goodbye to the castle. My three year old ran over to my phone to say goodbye. We're creating a Disney <laughs> monster. Oh, I love That's it. That's awesome, little Ruf. That is awesome. Oh my goodness. Well, hopefully they enjoyed saying goodnight to the castle. We're going to go say hello to Spaceship Earth very, very soon. Oh, yeah. We'll hopefully have we'll to. get there just in time to... If I may, honey, I hope... I think we are back now. Sorry about that, everybody. For some reason, it's a, a new dead zone back there. Not something we're used to running into. But we are back. Well, good, little Rufus, too. We're really That's glad awesome. that you enjoyed the cavalcade. Thank you, everybody. Thank you for letting us know that we are back. All right, honey, let me, uh, let me take that for a moment. Thank you. Oh, there's only like one little way out. There is one <laughs> little way out. One little exit. Tiny, tiny exit this way. And it's the complete opposite direction of the mother. It <laughs> sure is. But we're definitely taking the monorail to the TTC. TTC? Where we'll get the monorail to Epcot. Yeah, exactly. And Greg says, Monica, don't forget to check for the orange bird munchling at Epcot. Oh my gosh, I will not. Thank you so much, Greg Titus. Thank you, Greg. I'm hoping they restock it. There goes the train. That's the Royal Disney, right? It certainly is. Good eye, Annie. Shannon says, I miss Stumpy already. We have so much in common. Old, short, and dried up. <laughs> well, as long as you're both not bored, Shannon. Bored would be very bad. <laughs> that would be bad. All right, guys, let's catch the express monorail. It's just going to require we do some froggering here. Pin board. I like they that. Do. They do. Pin trade in there. If only they had that pin I'm looking for. <laughs> I love how everyone gets involved with the pin trading. Yeah. <laughs> Shannon's like, I don't know. Stumpy might be a board by now. That was loud. 
sorry, honey. I, we, you know, had some questionable things for dinner last night, and... That was not us. <laughs> My goodness. Be careful with, this is coffee. Yep, thank Someone you. Someone spilled a coffee. I get you. Beaker and honeydew, does Stumpy have a pin yet? You'll have to ask Ron. There you go. <laughs> I mean, spilled coffee, don't want to step on it, but man, oh man, it does smell good. Oh yeah. I guess that's how you know you have a coffee problem. over here so we're going to be heading towards uh, all the construction and everything oh. oh that AC feels nice our ride just showed up absolutely Yeah, that would be great, Greg. Yeah, that worked out really well, Marty. Absolutely. Oh no, sorry, the shift manager. And we're off to the Ticketed Transportation Center, everybody. Transportation and Ticket Center. about the log everybody we should be back now thank you everybody for letting us know that we are back thank you guys if you guys are not live please make sure that you refresh uh, make sure your live indicator is red Baker says, no, don't go away. Baker, we are on our way over to Epcot now. We enjoyed a beautiful afternoon in the Magic Kingdom. We're going to be enjoying a beautiful evening over at Epcot. Let's 
do some monorail hopping. You got it? Yep, thank you. We'll miss you too, Baker, but we'll catch you next time, sir. We'll be back in uh, Magic Kingdom on Friday if you're in the area. <laughs> and, uh, oh yeah, that's right. I always forget about the cut through. <laughs> I was going to make our lives a lot more difficult. I was like, to the left, honey. is it empty or right? Yeah, I think there's an empty spot uh, to the left. I don't know. Wherever I don't know either. Think. Yeah, so the game plan for this week, guys, is... Um, after tonight, enjoying Epcot, we'll be enjoying Epcot tomorrow again. Yeah. Uh, and then we'll be enjoying Magic Kingdom on Friday. Exactly. Looks like our monorail is already here, which is wonderful. I hope that's our monorail. Look at all the buses over there. It's yeah. so colorful. In the parking lot. It really is. What? Teal? Okay, the air conditioning was working on teal before. Yeah, it certainly was. So. Hopefully it still is. Well, thank you so much, Chris. We appreciate that. Enjoy your break time, sir. Yes, enjoy, Chris. Thank you. Thank you. Guys, let's get on the monorail. Oh yeah, that might be the better side, huh? Okay. That's it kind of looks like there was like water damage or something on that side. Really? Oh yeah, a little bit. I'm not sure if somebody spilled some liquids or something. I'm not sure. It sounds good, Chris. Hopefully we'll catch you later on tonight. That'd be awesome. Thank you, Chris. Shannon says, monorail jumping. Remember, jump across the tracks at least 10 seconds before it gets there. <laughs> oh boy. Have you guys ever paid attention to the control tower for the monorails? Lift your little thing up. Yeah, exactly, Marty, I'm right on time. And <laughs> that's why I'm back from the parts. Goodness, Shannon. Hey, but Pete, my girl, good to see you. Here we go. On our way back to Epcot, everybody. Welcome aboard the Walt Disney World monorail to Epcot. For those of you standing, please hold on to the handrails throughout our journey and stay clear of the doors. For the comfort of others, no smoking, please. Thank you. As we turn south, you can catch a glimpse of the spires of Space Mountain in the Magic Kingdom. Nearby is Disney's Contemporary Resort. Yeah. Oh, maybe. <laughs> I'll hold the gimbal for a moment so you can Thank see you. that. Because that looks rather uncomfortable. <laughs> We are indeed, Marty M. No worries. Oh, there we go. Yeah, we know that Harmonious tends to cause a lot of havoc, a lot of troubles with uh, streams, but we, we love the Harmonious uh, fireworks and the show. In yeah, general. the music, the fireworks. We're going to miss it. We will. But we're looking forward to Epcot Forever as well. It's just Harmonious was our first ever um, nighttime spectacular at Epcot that we enjoyed together. So it was. We really love it. Oh no, sounds good, Shannon.
Thank you, by the way, Marion. Welcome in, Bo Peep, my girl. And hello to Disney Mom 19 if you're there. Yes, welcome in, Bo Peep, and hello, Disney Mom 19. it over to Epcot. Yeah, this might, the, might be the fastest we've ever gotten there from uh, Magic. Don't jinx it. about that one because we haven't done it yet. <laughs> right? I mean, we got a little bit of time today. I don't know about that. <laughs> <laughs> we don't know what the open date is for Moana Journey of Water today uh, at this point in time. It's a very good question, we'll request it. Um, last, uh, last word was uh, Journey of Water inspired by Moana by Moana will open in World Nature at Epcot in fall of 2023. Oh, okay. Well then, very soon. In the grand scheme of things. Yeah. I don't know. Sharon says, well, I just got a call from my wife. She'll be gone for another two weeks. Now you just have to go on every night, so I won't be alone. <laughs> we'll try, Shannon. Um, <laughs> we'll definitely be back tomorrow. Um, tomorrow we're doing Epcot, right? Right. And then we won't be on Thursday. But Ron will. <laughs> that's true. And then we'll be back on Friday at Magic Kingdom. Yep. So that's the game plan for this week. That is a great point, Greg. We could do the Skylander when we're blocked out. Oh, that yeah, we'll be blocked out very soon. <laughs> we certainly will. So yes, very excellent point, Greg. Thank you. the uh, main show building for Guardians of the Galaxy. Will it be on our left? 
left or our right side? Uh, the construction will be on our right. Oh, okay. I got it. Oh, thank you. You're gonna put it on already? Yeah. Thank you. Alrighty. Also known as Spaceship Earth. <laughs> that was really cute. That little kid was so excited. <laughs> as soon as he heard Finding Nemo, he was like, that's it. That's all I want. Yeah. Welcome back, Mary. Hey, Mary. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Ready, honey. Okay, the temperature Epcot, feels amazing right now. Yeah, welcome back to Epcot, guys. It's gonna be one of the last times we see these banners up. That's, well, that's kind of crazy to think about. That's kind of sad thinking about that. Yeah, that is weird. It's a weird thought. <laughs> it is. Jeremy Heath is also excited about Nemo. <laughs> <laughs> that's awesome. That's awesome, Samantha. Samantha's sitting here bedazzling her daughter's dance costume for a competition while watching the stream. And they snuck in a hidden Mickey of gems. Oh, that's fantastic. Very cool, Samantha. And thank you so much for joining us. Absolutely. Oh, it feels a lot nicer right now, though. Doesn't it? The temperature. It says it's still 85, but my goodness, it's so much nicer. And tomorrow's <laughs> going to be a high of 80, so it's going to be yeah. five degrees cooler than this. Looking forward to tomorrow's temps. Right? Welcome in, Emily Smith. Oh no, Shannon. Shannon says, I give up. Last time I went diving, I couldn't find Nemo anywhere. <laughs> Why are you going to go to his, uh, the Finding Nemo tank Hey, Sherman, room. 42 Wallaby Way, Sydney. Oh, I was thinking the, like the second floor, you know, with all the tanks. Oh yeah, that one. Yeah. Yeah, that one's easier. And, and living with the land. Yeah, that, that's oh, I mean, not um, a bigger journey. The living seat. Living. It's not called living with the seas anymore, is it? Uh, 
I still refer to it as the Living Seas Pavilion. I, I don't know what it would be referred to as now. I don't know. It's where the Nemo ride is, guys. Like the aquarium, like, is it what, the second largest aquarium in the world? Something like that, absolutely. Something crazy like that. Honey, if I can have you take this real quick. Yep. I will hand sanitize. Yep. Oh, hey, right. welcome back, Grasshopper. Hey, Grasshopper. We have officially park hopped over to Epcot. Welcome to Epcot, everyone. Squirrels. Oh, squirrel. <laughs> Where's the other one? He's behind the trash can right now. Oh. Oh, no. <gasps> He's eating a popcorn. <laughs> oh, that's very cute. Hello, little he squirrel. He found the free popcorn. He did. We never find the free popcorn. But that squirrel did. That squirrel did. We need to ask the squirrel some questions. Sir? Uh, or ma'am? Sir, ma'am. Sir or ma'am. Uh, we need to ask you a few questions. Just uh, a few. First and foremost, where did you find the free popcorn? Also, why are you so adorable? Because we have been looking for the free popcorn. And clearly you found it. I know. Oh, he's showing us right now. He's like, the free popcorn's right here, guys. It's literally right here. Look at how easy this is. <laughs> That's awesome. That's cute. That's a very cute squirrel. Isn't it? Very smart about how you eat popcorn, too. Oh, yeah. Oh, and by the way, since we're here, this yeah. is where the Leave a Legacy wall is now. So if you guys ever did the Leave a Legacy with the... Like, you know, the big rocks that were in the center on your way in before you, um, just in the entrance. Yeah. Now they um, they have them on this wall back here. That's fair. Just wanted to let everybody know in case they were wondering where this is at. That's true. Bye, Welcome. very cute squirrel. Bye, Enjoy very your cute. popcorn. Exactly. Welcome in, Emily Smith. Welcome in, Sean C. And welcome in, Cindy Petit. Welcome in, guys. Welcome in. Welcome in. <laughs> Sorry, I can't speak. I was like, that squirrel. He's so cute. Uh, welcome in, Mark Birchfield. Hey, Mark. <laughs> Shannon said, he's running. He stole it. Guilty. <laughs> it is technically free popcorn. Right? <laughs> that was really cute. Cindy Petit says, you said my name right. Well, good. I was worried that we I try. said that wrong. <laughs> <laughs> we try our best. And if we don't, just correct us, guys. Absolutely. And if we mess up again, just correct us again. We'll work on it. We'll fix it. Yep. We'll get there eventually. Welcome in, Sean C. Hey, Sean C. And there is beautiful Spaceship Earth, everybody. Welcome to Epcot. Welcome to Epcot. Mark oh. Birchfield says, this is my first time watching. Well, you picked a great live stream to come in for the first time, Mark. We uh, did a lot of awesome things over at Magic Kingdom. We're over here now at the Flower and Garden Festival at Epcot. Yeah. Did some park hopping. So uh, we're looking forward to enjoying a little bit of our evening here at Epcot. Yeah, we try to go live on YouTube from the park, so we live stream Monday, Wednesday, and Friday, and sometimes more. Yep. And we are the Park Hoppers. We I'm Monica. Are. And I'm Eric. And thank you so much for joining us. Yeah. Consider subscribing if you enjoy the channel. Yep. Mark Birchfield says, just found you guys. I watch Ron on the go a lot. Okay, oh, we'll that's probably awesome. see you in chat then. Let's uh, head down this way. Thank you, ma'am. Thank you. Oh, well, thank you so much, Mark. We appreciate that. I didn't have that. my, uh, I didn't position thank my you. finger very well. Right? Oh, gotcha. Yeah, so I was just taking a little longer. Sorry about that. No, you're good. Mark said subscribed already. Oh, thank you so much, Mark. Well, thank you for being nice to it, Mark. We appreciate that. And the Encanto beautiful, beautiful topiaries are here. The trees are starting to uh, flower behind they it. They look so that? much more colorful. So welcome to Epcot's Flower and Garden Festival, everybody. That's beautiful. Mary Carol says, I'm glad that I joined this stream. I think that this is my first time watching. Well, thank you so much, Mary Carol. Thank you very much, Mary. We have enjoyed having you here with us today as well.
They did such a great job with these topiaries. So beautiful. Oh, James Davidson is here. Welcome in, James. Hey, James. I love how epic the music is at Epcot. It's always just so grand. It's really beautiful, I think, like relaxing. Mm -hmm. I like to, you know, you're at Epcot now. You can relax. Oh no, Megan caved and bought a Magic Band Plus. <laughs> oh, okay, which one, Megan? Did you get the pink Tiana one or the blue one? It's one of those two, I think. Probably. And then she surprises us and says, no, 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 I got the, the partner statue one. No. <laughs> I think Megan got the blue Tiana or the pink Tiana. I'm just curious as to which one. Alrighty. Thank you, Anna. Oh, Marty M, thank you so much. That is our Patreon um, link, guys. We do have a Patreon where we uh, do like Patreon-only live streams and such. Yep. If you want to check it out, there is where you can. Absolutely. Thank oh, you so much, Marty M. Thank you, Marty M. Terry Kessler says they're going to Disney World in August next year for their birthday. Can't wait. First time ever. That's amazing, Terry. You're going to have an amazing time. And make sure you plan ahead, like any restaurants that are like need reservations, book them as soon as you can because reservations, like they fill up quickly. Right. I don't think you can reserve them so it far ahead. It depends on what kind of, um, I think it depends on your pass level and such. Fair. But that's why I was just saying as soon as you can. Yeah. Little Rue Plus 2 got the Tinkerbell one. Oh, the Jeez, Tinkerbell? That's that awesome. one's cute. Rob says they have the partner statue 50th one. Yeah, oh, that's a great Rob one. has that one. I'm not sure yep. which one M has. Shannon I assume says, an aerial one. <laughs> Shannon says Magic Band. Does it do any tricks, like card tricks and stuff? I wish. That'd be pretty awesome. Nothing on my sleeve, but this Magic Band on my wrist. Oh, bam! Is this your card? <laughs> <laughs> Emily Smith says I'll be back in three weeks. Hope the weather isn't too warm. We hope not too, Emily. Yeah, hopefully it stays, uh, like right around here is perfect. Yeah, th right now it's 85 degrees, it's uh, breezy, it's it's a beautiful day. Thank you so much, JB. JB says, very good tip, Monica, 60 days out for resorts. Gotcha. And then uh, Bo Peak Micro was saying DVC can reserve at different times as well. That's awesome. Thank you, everybody. <sighs> so you want to head into Creation Shop? I do, just to see if they have the orange burn munch thing. Yep. We'll go check that out, see if they have that uh, pen you were looking for as well while yeah. we're here. I mean, it wasn't at the Emporium. Right. So I'm not sure, but they might have it. They might. You want to check out Club Cool afterwards? Yes. Always love, yeah. The cucumber striped. Ooh, yes. It calls to me. Sounds refreshing to me. Leo Epcot Fan 21, welcome in. Hey, Leo. And hey, Kayla, welcome in. Welcome in, Kayla. Yes, we were, thank you so much. Yeah, we are feeling tremendously better. Thank you so much, Kayla. Yeah, and we were, uh, we were already starting to feel better yesterday, but we just wanted to take one extra day just to make sure. Uh, just always gotta be mindful of those around you as well, you know? Do you right, wanna stop in Club Cool first and then go sure. to the store and then go back to Club Cool? <laughs> if you'd like to, sure. I'm really thirsty. Jeff Davis says, gotta get a big gulp of Beverly. Oh, Beverly Jeff Davis? Really? Really Jeff Davis? Oh, yeah, Beverly? Thank you. Excuse. It's the best. It's the best? Yeah, Is you, it number you, one? You gotta drink a big cup of it and then convince other people to too. Oh no, I would <laughs> never do that to anybody. Oh, thank you so much, little grasshopper. All right, I'm very thirsty. Oh my gosh, where is Sprite Cucumber? No. They have no, Beverly what is and this? they have Chinese. Oh, can they give me soda water? <laughs> <laughs> There's uh, Viva here, honey. Huh? They've got Viva here, but otherwise oh it's gosh. all Beverly and uh, the barbecue one. Oh no. 
Oh no, I'm very sad. I'm gonna ask. It's no. Okay. You huh? can, but uh, it's not gonna be free. No, if I can just get soda water. I know. Strange question. Do you guys have just like soda water? Like. Uh, oh, like carbonated water. Yeah, carbonated water. No. no. Oh, okay. I was looking forward for the sprite, but all the sprites are out. <laughs> Thank you. Oh. And they what? Oh, gotcha. I was looking for something complimentary. <laughs> is it good? Or is it? People come and get it here a lot. Yeah. I'm proud of myself, but it's. We'll try it. We'll try your water. <laughs> A little bit. I didn't know the water was so popular here. <laughs> Hi, everybody. Hello, everybody. John La Lalas. La Las? Welcome in, John Lalas. Welcome in, John. Thank you so much for subscribing. Thank you. Thank you, man. You too. <laughs> I'm just, I'm very like hot. <laughs> I understand. Thank you. It's actually pretty good. Yes. Oh, yeah. It's not bad. It's just the only drink I like here is uh, the Sprite Cucumber. Right. I don't really like much of the other ones. Yeah. Well, and the other ones I do like are sold out or like empty. Gotcha. This Do you like is, the raspberry? I don't know. I can't remember. This is the Viva Moldova. Yeah. I think that one was okay. Not bad. Not bad? It's uh, definitely tart. Oh, tart? No, yeah. thank you. <laughs> That's a nice sweet finish, though. Oh, I'll stick with my, uh, with my water. <laughs> Welcome in, Monica Simpson. And just because everyone's been asking for it, I'll try some Beverly in a second as well. Oh my gosh, guys, he's going to do Beverly for you. Oh my gosh. Oh no, he's going to do the Beverly. Don't do it. Ah, There's gross. on there. So Beverly, for those of you who don't know, it's a, it's a bitter, non-alcoholic drink, which tends to uh, be a palate cleanser. And uh, it's kind of, it, it tastes a lot like uh, grapefruit rind if you were to make it into a soda. Well, it's described as Beverly with its bitter flavor is a popular non-alcoholic aperitif, aperitif? Aperitif. That is a traditional part of Italian refreshment culture. Yep. No, thank you. It's not terrible. That's what you say. I can't handle it. I can't handle Beverly. Justin Frank, exactly. Brave soul. <laughs> okay, let me, uh, exactly. Let me finish it off here. Oh my gosh. Donardo says, yes, Beverly, with laughy faces. Yes, exactly, Jeremy Heath. Beverly with barbecue chaser. Gross. Not the greatest. Well, I think I will follow with Thank you, Monica for being here. Oh, man. End it with raspberry, at least, yeah. Beverly with the barbecue chaser. Oh, uh, no. No, 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 no. That tastes like, the barbecue that's like one. <laughs> barbecue liquid smoke gone wrong. That's no. really strange, Jeff Davis. That is crazy. Yeah, uh, of the ones available, Viva is the only one that's uh, decent. <laughs> yeah, no, the only one I like here, I love the, okay, I love the Bon Bon, that's the Madagascar. I love the Minute Maid Joy Apple Lychee. The Country Club one from Dominican Republic is pretty good. Royal Watermelon is pretty good, but I absolutely love the Sprite Cucumber. That's like yeah. my number one. So, I got some water. <laughs> yep. I love um, carbonated water. Uh, soda water is my like go-to thing, but if they don't have that, uh, just regular water is my favorite. <laughs> That's fair. Oh man, they are out of a lot of it at this point in time, but uh, they will be refilling them soon, guys. They do too. Uh, they do tend to be really good about that. It's just uh, it's been real busy lately. <laughs> <laughs> that was a very kind family. That was. Right, head into the creation shop, uh, go check those things, and then we'll head back out towards uh, Spaceship Earth and 
See some of the light shows out there? <laughs> like Marty M said, all the favorites are gone. Yeah. Exactly. Maybe just it's so busy. So, that might be part of it. That's true. Okay, I'm looking, I'm looking. I don't see anything. Oh, look at the Dumbo. That's so cute. Let's make it more comfortable. <gasps> He's so cute. He's really cute. That's a Cuddles. Well, I, I say it wrong. Oh no, it's Terry Kessler. Cud Good luck. Cuddlies. But I call it Cuddles. <laughs> Oh yeah, good luck, Terry. Baker Nani do say park hoppers is the shortage of toilet paper like we had a couple of years ago, running the different flavors of Coke. <laughs> it seems to be the case, huh? Yes, Little Rufus too. It's right next door to uh, Creation Shop. Actually, there's the, the ceiling that we were just under while we were in there. Mm-hmm. Okay, I'm going to hand this over to you, if yeah. that's all right. Um, and, yes. Thank you. Shannon, I absolutely love carbonated water. The burps you can get from that stuff is amazing. I almost broke a window once. <laughs> That's never happened to me, Shannon. But I do like carbonated water. <laughs> Soda water with a lime or lemon or orange or any fruit, really. I can go on and on about this, but I'm not going to bore everybody. You, just, so, you like fresh fruit soda? I like fresh fruit soda, yes. Thank you. And then look at the Easter eggs. These are cute, right? They are. These are uh, for the extravaganza, and these cost $14.99. Thank you. And then, don't forget Zootopia. I love how they have Flash in there. So cute. <laughs> All right, let's look for new things. The roof was to say, okay, everyone remain calm. This is a munchlings hold up. Flash, maybe <laughs> some light shopping. Everyone Hopefully. remain calm and no one will... Ooh, have a like. <laughs> I'm hoping they have the munchling. I, I'm a little doubtful that they've brought it back just yet, but we'll look. Marnium says, when you get a chance, new people would like to see your faces. Oh, they want to see our faces? Oh, oh but the store is so much prettier. <laughs> we'll show our faces once we exit the store. There you go. <laughs> Thank you for the reminder, Marnium. We appreciate that. I'm not right, seeing let's it. See here. <laughs> they restocked the uh, Little Mermaid Dooney and Burks, though. They certainly did. Did you see Jeff Davis is coming? I didn't. So when I go to Publix and think who would buy a LaCroix, now, oh no, no Jeff Davis, I don't drink those. <laughs> I actually really don't like those at all. It tastes really weird to me. I like just like regular soda water with like fresh fruit. Oh yeah. I don't like that like weird tasting stuff. <laughs> but if you know, if you like LaCroix, all power to you. No judgment here. It's just not my thing. Right. <gasps> oh, be careful so behind you. It's probably in the orange fruit area. I've been hearing about these. These are pretty new for the uh, festival, for the Flower and Garden Festival. They have these Tupperwares. I thought it was a set of three, but I guess you could it's like, you either get the small one, Let's see. It may still be a set of three. Is it a set of three, you think? Because there's, there's no, no price. price. Tag on that this one. is the small one. Are they dishwasher safe or? Well, I think it's at, like it's legitimate Tupperware brand. So it should be. Um, wash. It doesn't say. It says made in Mexico. I wouldn't dishwasher to be, I don't know, because Tupperware should be fine in the dishwasher. Should be. That's the medium one. Mm. Oh no, we missed a fight apparently that we were just showing. What? Oh my God, we were showing a fight? No, we're sorry guys. The little girl was beating her brother's butt. Oh, okay, it wasn't like a real fight, okay. See, it's actual Tupperware brand. So Greg, Publix is our grocery store. It's uh, like it's, the most well, common grocery store. It's one of the common Florida. grocery stores yeah. here, yeah. But see, this one has a price, $19.99. So I wonder if it's $20 just for this one. Oh no, because this one's $13. Oh, so they're priced differently. Oh, they're all individual. That's expensive Tupperware. Oh, this one's $10. Wow. Um, I do like Tupperware and I do like Orange Bird, but not for that price. <laughs> <laughs> but that is new. That's a new item. Now, do they have the munching? No, so far, I'm not seeing it. I'm not seeing it either. Yeah, Marty M, you're right. It is not a set. It's sold individually. Yep. 
<laughs> Chef Davis, it should. It should. Oh no, I'm not seeing it. <laughs> <sighs> well, we might have to come back sad, early sad. tomorrow and see if it comes in early, you know? Oh yeah, maybe. Yeah, we'll be back tomorrow. We'll take another look. Yep. <laughs> you wanna Leo Epcot fan, 21. It's legitimate brand Tupperware product. Yes. That's what it says. That stuff is as stiff as a shot of whiskey with no whiskey. <laughs> oh, yeah, look, Croy. Yeah. Hey, Kimberly Hazard. Welcome in. Thank Great you. to see you. All right, so let's head out. Yep, let's do it. You want to go this way? Yep, let's uh, head out that way, yeah. You want to head back towards uh, Spaceship Earth or? I was still keeping an eye for the Munchling. Oh, gotcha. I'm like, <laughs> where is she? <laughs> I'm shopping. I know, that's why it's so important that I keep an eye on you. Oh, is that so? <laughs> Oh, Marnium says check the Odyssey. Oh, that would be a That's good That's a good point. I like your train of thought, Marnium. What are the wait times like here in Epcot right now? Oh, yeah. I don't know. Oh, we got to show our faces, Marnium oh, said. Oh, yes, yes, yes. Because Marty said. <laughs> uh, wait times. Let's come up to this trash can up you here want next to the trash uh, can? popcorn. Yeah. Okay, yeah, we can do that one. Whichever trash can you wish. Well, that one's a little too close to the popcorn. It might smell really good. <laughs> <laughs> All right, guys. Let's sit you down, turn you around. You ready, honey? Yeah. Here we go. Check in wait times. Gotcha. Hello, everybody. Oh, wrong way. Come Eric on, come wants on. to just show himself. Because of his sparkly eyes, right, guys? He, re he ran away. He left me alone. So, hello, everybody. We are the Park Hoppers. We're Eric and Monica. We go live from the park several times a week. Yes. And we did some park hopping today. We started over at the well, Magic Kingdom. We started here. Well, we started here. Then well, we not went, like here, here, but like well, right outside the gate. Outside of here. Right. Outside of Epcot. And uh, took the monorail over to the Magic Kingdom. Yes. And then enjoy the Magic Kingdom and during our afternoon with you guys. Hops back over here to Epcot. We're going to enjoy Epcot a little bit. Uh, we've got an hour and a half before Harmonious. Yes. So we've got some time to do some things. Living with the Land is five minutes. You want to go over to Living with Who the Land? Who wants to go on Living with the Land? Just me? Let's Anybody else? <laughs> I hope somebody else wants to go on Living with the Land. Let's go enjoy some Living with the Land, guys. It's five minutes. That's good, right? Yeah. That's a walk on. Oh, so, but who we are. Yeah. Because like, so, we should probably yeah. go over that real quick. That is important, yeah. So uh, again, Monica, Eric, we're the park hoppers. That's us. We go live from the park several times a week. If you have enjoyed what you've seen today and if you'd like to join us again in the future as we go about uh, our business running around Walt Disney World all the time. Walking quickly around Walk, Walt Disney Walking briskly around we Disney don't World. Run. No, that is, that is a good point. No running. Please consider subscribing. We'd love to have you along with us again in the future, guys. Thank you so much. Let's go on a ride. Oh, and this is my shirt, because somebody was asking me what shirt. Oh, yeah. Here we go. Yeah. It's Donald's. Oh, not that way. There. Donald Duck. Number one duck. It's number one. Sharice, right, welcome in. Welcome in, Sharice. Right, let's head over to Living with the Land. Five let's minutes is a walk on. It certainly is. With the land. Yes, lots of familiar faces in chat. We're always, always so pleased to see everyone here. You, you want guys some water? are what makes this so much fun. Yes, please. Thank the water's you. actually pretty, like, it's a lot better than most other waters in the park. I would so, say so, yeah. Yeah, which is weird. I wonder why. I don't know. Might be a better way of uh, purifying for that location. But yeah, what is really awesome about a lot of Disney um, quick service locations, they'll usually give you complimentary water. True. That is true. It's really, really nice of them. Well, it's a pleasure to meet you, Cindy Petit. Yes, a pleasure, Cindy. We've seen you over in a few chats. I think most recently, um, Wes? <laughs> probably. Yeah, probably. Yeah, because Wes does say her name correctly now, too. Oh, does he? <laughs> yeah. Awesome. Last week checked. <laughs> Beautiful. Oh, it's so pretty. Look at the flowers. Oh, I should probably do a video of this. You want a video of this? I just don't know where to cut across. <laughs> Here we go. That is a pretty picture right there. Jess Scott Disney says, Megan, two weeks ago, I got the 100th anniversary year at Disney Springs. That's awesome, Jess. Oh, and Megan said, what kind of, uh, okay. Megan said, okay, so now that I'm not cooking, I got the light pink magic band and got a 50th skin off of Etsy because the castle will not look like how it does for much longer and it was cheaper. Oh. Well, that's awesome, Megan. Very good thinking. Oh, no. What happened? 
Uh, Cherie said, I checked the van site and they don't have that bucket hat anymore. Yeah, the van's hat went very quickly. It sold out fast. It really did. Samantha says, you might want to bring a lemon to put uh, in that free water. Yeah, lemon would be great. Sounds lemon good, Marty. Lemon would be nice, yeah. All right, let's make our way over to the land. Let's go I get love on living with the land. And just uh, to finish off the uh, lemon, I love any citrus or fruit in water. Mm -hmm. So good. Oh no, my hand, hold on. <laughs> Shannon says water is free in the restrooms too. Oh, I don't get my free water in the restroom, Shannon. <laughs> <laughs> don't know about that one, Shannon. <laughs> This is really pretty though, especially with all the flowers. Oh yeah. Yeah, Shannon typically offers great advice. I don't think I'd typically, follow that one. Typically, yeah. <laughs> Maybe not complimentary water in the bathrooms. <laughs> all right, guys. Yeah, those were some popping colors, absolutely. I love the uh, floating plant trees as well, how purple and uh, pink they've become now. Yeah. They're really starting to um, bloom. They really are. So guys, tomorrow, we're gonna be doing a uh, full live stream about the uh, Flower and Garden Festival here at Epcot. We're gonna be enjoying as much of Epcot as possible and we're gonna be saying goodbye to Harmonious. Harmonious. We're gonna be seeing it for the last time, guys. Yeah. So if you guys want to be a part of that, we'd be honored to take you along again. We'll be live tomorrow. Oh goodness, what did we set it for? I have no idea what check. time we'll be live for. I <laughs> think it was 4 p.m.? I think it was 4. Something like that. Let's see, tomorrow, right? Tomorrow, yep. Yep, at 4 o'clock. Awesome, so 4 p.m. EDT, we'll be live again tomorrow, guys. We're not signing off just yet. We're going to oh, be no. enjoying uh, living with the land. We're going to maybe check out some of the shows on Spaceship Earth. And we're going to enjoy Harmonious before we call it a night. That's a great question, Alicia. We will have to figure that out because we do have a number of favorite places to watch Harmonious from. Uh, it all depends on, you know, how uh, busy certain areas are and where we are as the time comes closer. And um, I'm gonna go ahead and put it in the chat, guys. This is the link for tomorrow's live stream. Um, if you guys would like to check it out, give it a thumbs up. We'd really appreciate that, guys. That would thank be you. very, very awesome. And thank you. <laughs> so we are making our way on up to Living, Living with, with the, the Land. Hey, look, can I go put my foot in the there's been a lot of really excited kids today. <laughs> there have been, it's awesome. All right, let's hang a left and start our climb. Got a hike up into the land. <laughs> That's true, Megan. The mayor and Shannon's humor are very similar. <laughs> Shannon says, thank you, Megan. I'm a dad and a grandpa. My humor is, wait, I thought it was advice. Oh, man. Oh, Jeff Davis is saying, down in South Florida, where I'm from originally, water with lemon was known as Boca Cocktail. <laughs> was there any alcohol? <laughs> oh, I can feel the air conditioning from the land pavilion. Oh, it feels nice inside. It does. We need to drink the rest of this water before we go on the ride, though. That is true. It is very true. Thank you. Just got Disney says, Eric, Monica, my birthday is coming up in three weeks. I'll be 23 on April 18th. That's amazing, oh, Jess. That's awesome. Happy early birthday, Jess. Happy early birthday. Megan says, I love the land, rides, and food. What could be better? You've so got a very true. good point. <laughs> the Garden Grill is here. We haven't been, but it always smells amazing. It does. It's a character dining, and it always smells so good. There's Pluto. Pluto. 
That's very That's cute. That's awesome. All right. Let's head down the escalator. Down the escalator we go. <laughs> Shannon says, living with the land? I do that every time my wife kicks me out of the house. Oh, no. <laughs> It's literally a walk on. We're gonna have to throw this away in that trash can. Probably. <laughs> so, welcome to Living Did, with the Land. Should we ask for the front or the back? Uh, probably the front. Yeah. And then I'll turn the brightness all the way down so we don't obstruct anyone's view. No, thank you. No more? Appreciate it, though. I have a few more lines. I could have a few more sips. Yeah, I'll just stuff to the side. Thank Thanks you. Thanks so much. Thank you. Last sip. Sure. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you so much, man. Okay. Thank you. Oh, Patty says you guys really need to try Garden Girl. We want to. One day we will. Absolutely. So guys, as we go through living with the land, we may keep a signal and we may lose it in different parts. Uh, just be advised, uh, we will be doing everything we can to keep it as long as we can. And if we lose it, we'll be doing everything we can to get it back. And of course, once we get on the ride, we will be quiet. Sorry guys, just a moment. Parents, please supervise your chain and refrain from the flash photography. We're using video lights until we just go in. Oh, there we go. Now, sit back, relax, and enjoy living in the land. For su seguridad, permanezca sentado con sus manos y brazos, pies y piernas dentro del parque. Y cuida los pequeños. A manera de recordatorio, no tomar fotos atrás y luz de video antes de llegar a mi andar. One of those living systems is the rainforest, home to the most amazing concentration of life on our planet. These dense and beautiful forests cover only a tiny portion of the Earth's surface, but they contain more than half of its plant and animal species. 
Rainforests are also extremely rich in productive living systems, providing us with oxygen, food, medicines, and other elements essential to our lives. In the desert, nature has created a very different, but no less beautiful, living system. And while this arid landscape may seem lifeless, it is very much alive. The plants and animals that have learned to survive in these harsh conditions make use of what little water they can find and avoid the scorching rays of the relentless sun. The American prairie once appeared as desolate as the desert, but over time, rainwater and nutrients gradually penetrated the hard surface of this land. Even the hooves of the mighty buffalo helped create the rich soil that would one day become home to the American farm. Tropics are home to the greatest diversity of plants on the planet. Many of these, like papaya, 
bananas, cacao, coffee, and rice are well known around the world. These are just a few of the edible plants that have been an important source of nutrition for people living in the tropics. Many are rich in vitamins and minerals, while others are well adapted to growing in less than ideal conditions. Some, like the watermelon, thrive in wet, sloppy areas and waterways. All parts of this plant, even the flower petal, are edible. The starchy root of the plant has long been used to make flour for baking. One day, many of these lesser-known tropical plants may be as important as the bananas growing on both sides of the boat. More than 28 million tons of bananas are eaten annually, making it the most popular fruit in the world. While there are more than 50,000 edible plant species in the world, most of us are only familiar with the handful that make up our everyday diet. The common grains growing here, wheat, maize, sorghum, and millet, plus rice, account for nearly two-thirds of our global food consumption. Learning how to increase yields of these staples is an important goal of research around the world. These plants are definitely on their way up. Innovative growing techniques like these increase yields while more efficiently using resources like water, fertilizer, and pesticides. Another innovation at work here is our integrated pest management program. By populating our greenhouses with beneficial insects that prey on harmful pests like aphids and flies, we are significantly reducing our reliance on conventional pesticides. We're growing these crops using our nutrient film system. This technique precisely controls and recycles water and nutrients. With it, we can produce over 27,000 heads of lettuce a year in this one small area.
Some of our best ideas have been inspired by nature. Like this. Please keep your hands inside the boat at all times. By growing these ground plants vertically, we can increase yields and better control diseases. These crops taste as good as they look. In fact, we serve more than 15 tons of produce from our greenhouses and restaurants here at the land every year. of the space required by traditional growing methods. That saves water and increases production. The aquaponics system on your left combines hydroponics with aquaculture. The fish provide a natural source of fertilizer for the plants, and the plants help keep water clean. It's another great way to produce more while using the water. Please remain fully seated inside the boat. In the of the U.S. Department of Agriculture on a number of innovative projects. The goal of these efforts is to produce higher yieldings and better hands in the plant inside the boat and remain seated until the boat comes to a complete stop. Sorry guys, just in my hand for a second. There we go. Much better. There we go. One and two. Cool, cool, cool. So that was the living with the land, everybody. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Absolutely. Sorry about that little bit of lag that we had at the very start and the very end there. Yeah. Welcome back, Shannon, Day for Disney. Welcome in anybody who uh, joined us for Living with the Land. Thank you so much for being here with us. Welcome, welcome back, Paul. Welcome back, Paul. How are you feeling? And uh, Mickey is from Japan. Welcome oh. in, Mickey. Welcome in, 
Mickey. Thank you so much for being here from Japan. That's amazing. They don't uh, speak English very well, but they love watching. So thank you oh, so much for being you. here. thank you. I wish I knew Japanese. But we unfortunately do not. Yeah, I, I, I can't think of... All, all I know is arigato, which is thank you, so yep. arigato. Oh, perfect. <laughs> and I only know how to say three, two, one, san ni ichi. <laughs> But uh, that's as far as my Japanese skills go. Uh, <laughs> I'm konnichiwa? sorry. Oh, is, I don't know. I'm not sure what Konichi was. But I know Arigato, so. That is good. <laughs> Welcome in, Mr. Disney King. Welcome in, everybody. All right. All right. Garden Grill smells amazing. <laughs> and we were on the ride, too, and it's like there's like little spots of living with the land where Garden Grill, like, interacts with and it's like oh I get some of the food and it's like we'll have to eat there one day. Oh yeah. For, <laughs> for sure. sure. Oh a Japanese YouTuber works. <laughs> gotcha. Thank you. Paul said so if you were waiting to get on this ride you'd be in the landline. <laughs> Good one, That's Paul. Fair. Did Paul say how he's doing? Yeah he said just a moment ago. He oh. said uh, that he's feeling much better. Oh where much better. Time. Okay. Yes. So glad to hear it Paul. All right. So what do you think, honey? Out to the uh, front of the park to see the oh yes, the spaceship, the, uh, spaceship Earth uh, light show. Mm -hmm. That'd be awesome. And then we'll find our place for harmonies. That sounds great. Well, welcome in, James. Oh, Sisson. thank you, James. <laughs> Glad you're done with work for the day. Oh yeah, that is always such a relieving feeling. It really is. Ooh, we'll be able to try the new path. Yes, the new pass. Which is kind of boring to watch, I'm sure, because it's literally walls on either side, but <laughs> it's a new thing. It is new. <laughs> wow. Where did the AC from the land go? I know. It still is not as bad as it was earlier, obviously, because the sun's set it. <laughs> yeah. But it is a warm one. That is a good point, Mr. Disney King. There has not been word yet on what they're going to be doing about the uh, light shows on Spaceship Earth when the 50th ends. So, quite curious about what is going to happen there. Curious to see whether or not they keep most of the light shows that they've been doing. Uh, maybe they'll drop the, uh, the typical 50th anniversary one. But uh, maybe they'll keep the others and continue it as a thing. Yeah, maybe. That'd be great. Paul's letting us know it's still warm 84 degrees there now. Yeah, but let me tell you what, this 84 degrees feels tremendously better than the 88 earlier today. <laughs> On Those the right, four degrees make such a difference. As they say on the right we're passing is the uh, Toy Story topiaries. Yeah. You have Woody, Bo Peep, the sheep. Very cool. A beautiful evening. So yes, the Guardians of the Galaxy virtual queue is closed. I know I saw somebody asking about that earlier. Uh, although you probably weren't able to see that sign, it, that is what that sign was saying. <laughs> <laughs> 76 degrees by midnight. Ooh, that'll feel great. Thank you, Paul. Tarrant, welcome in. It says Epcot over all the other lands in Walt Disney World. And Tarrant, is that Tarrant or uh, Taro? Oh, it could be Taro. I'm not sure. I'm sorry if I mispronounced no, that. No, <laughs> I'm just asking because like, I, I will just immediately adopt Tear it, and I just don't want to yeah. get her on, you know? I don't either. Marty, I'm like, they better keep those shows. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Leo Epcot fan was saying, in the area where the uh, Fountain of Nations used to be, I think Imagineering kept the Epcot logo on the walkway. Oh, well, that'd, that'd be, be cool. amazing. Let's that'd be really, really nice. Oh, and it might be more visible during the day. That is true. But we'll take a look anyway. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, Mr. Disney King, we cannot imagine Spaceship Earth without those lights either. They put a lot of work into those lights, so I can't see them leaving anytime soon. Yeah. Oh, that's beautiful. So here's the walkway that they just opened up, everybody. Oh my goodness. Thank you so much, Shannon. Shannon, Shannon D for Disney. $9.99 from Shannon D for Disney. She says, thanks for streaming the magic of Disney. Well, thank you, Shannon. Thank you so much, Shannon. Very, very much appreciate that. Douglas Potter, welcome in. 
Welcome in, Douglas. Douglas says, love seeing the hydroponics as well as everything you've done today. I was the 200 thumbs up today. Oh, and hope thank everyone you. will remember to give you a thumbs up if they haven't done it yet. Well, thank <laughs> you so much, Douglas. Thank you so much, guys. We appreciate all the thumbs up. We appreciate all the subscriptions, all the support. Absolutely. Really, really means a lot to us, guys. Thank you, everybody. We've got a wall of foliage on our right right now. That's interesting. You hear those sprinklers going. <laughs> sure do. Oh, and if you guys do subscribe, which would be amazing, um, also if you'll ring that notification bell and set it to all so that you'll get alerts when we go live. Absolutely. Thank you, guys. Thank you, everybody. So they're wrapping up one of the shows right now. Oh no, it's just starting. It's the 40th anniversary one that's going right now. Oh my goodness. <laughs> 270 likes. Thank you so much, everybody. We appreciate that. Thank you, guys. Theo Samigo says, sounds like spring is overly sprung there. Where's the 70s when you need them? Right? right? The breeze feels really great right now, though. Oh, Jose Cher is here. Hola, Jose Cher. Hola, Jose. Como esta usted y la familia? What? Feliz Martes. Feliz Martes. Yep. Yeah. I was like, what day is it? Wait. Yeah, that's a, I had to think a moment. I'm like, wait, yeah. it's Tuesday, right? Yeah. Shannon said, that's right, all you samurai watchers out there. Hit the like button and enjoy the fun. Or is it ninja? They both scare me, so either works. <laughs> all right, guys, so we'll get all set up and we'll watch each of the uh, light shows until we hit this uh, 40th anniversary one again. Once we hit this one again and enjoy it, we'll know that we have watched all of the shows that they have yeah. to offer. And uh, then we'll make our way over towards Harmonious. Monorail. Monorail too. We've seen that monorail quite a few times today. We were in it twice. To and from Epcot. Thank you for taking us to Magic Kingdom. Monorail too. Oh, thank you very much, Shannon. <laughs> Let me get all set up. So that's the very end of the 40th anniversary uh, light show on Spaceship Earth. We will be catching that one again in a few moments. It'll cycle through each of the shows and uh, yeah, we'll be catching it. Let's get back over here. We'll back up a little ways just to make it a little easier to see Spaceship Earth here. Because uh, this is a very big golf ball, everybody. <laughs> oh, that's an awesome uh, wheelchair. 
<laughs> oh, wow. They put rope lights on the uh, wheels. That's awesome. That is really cool, actually. That way you kind of, you know, that's a really great idea, especially for Epcot, because it gets really dark in certain areas. So it really does. For visibility, that's really smart. Should we back up further, or are we good here, you think? We've got a tree is the only thing. Yeah. So a little bit more in the way of people. <laughs> this should be good right over here. <laughs> Leo Epcot fan. Oh, Eric, golf ball. Come on, buddy. I'm sorry, Leo. Okay, it's a geodesic sphere. Does that help? <laughs> that is called Spaceship Earth. Spaceship Earth. <laughs> Can anyone tell me how many sides there are on this GOT6 sphere? That I would be curious to find out. So Samantha, it's not, it is it is not a golf ball. I'm sorry, everybody. I shouldn't have said that. Well, you only said that because like a lot. It's very commonly referred to as a golf ball. It is a geo uh, geo geodesic sphere. sphere mm -hmm. Also Which known means it, it, as spaceship Earth. Yep, it's a giant ball that's made up of angles. Yeah. Hey, welcome back, Andon. Welcome back, Andon. And Leo's like, I appreciate that. <laughs> <laughs> Shannon says, Samantha, football didn't fit right. People kept hitting their heads on it. <laughs> right, and uh, the tennis ball they found just to be a little too furry. So uh, <laughs> they stuck with, uh... oh geez, Leo says there's 11,324 tiles. Wow. So there you go, everybody. There are 11,324 sides to this geodesic sphere. <laughs> well, thank you for that, Leo. That's awesome, Leo. Thank you. Oh, it is a little bit warm feeling. There just there hasn't been a there's like a little bit of a breeze walking this way, so that was really nice and yeah. pleasant. And now just stands in here, the breeze kind of dissipated. <laughs> it did, but that's all right. Yeah, no, it's beautiful. So so beautiful. It's so much better out right now than it was earlier today. Oh my goodness. Paul says the, uh, the Epcot Geodesic Sphere is 165 feet in diameter. There's 11,520 triangles and 3,840 points. Goodness gracious. Thank you, Paul. And thank you, Leo. I feel like this could easily turn into a mouth, uh, mouth class. <laughs> you guys want to do a little trigonometry? Oh, no. I don't like math. Back it up to some geometry. That's beautiful. Whatever you want to call Spaceship Earth, it is beautiful. <laughs> that was a very kind guest. The roof was too, says 954 faces. Quite frankly, guys, you could be throwing out like wildly ridiculous numbers and we'd be like, really? That's amazing. <laughs> Good to see you again, Andon. Thank you for being here. Yes, thank you. The Rufus said uh, 954 triangular faces. The 11,000 plus number are the joints, I think. That would make uh, sense as well. If there are, goodness, I, I don't know. 11,520 triangles does seem like a lot of triangles. That does seem like a lot of triangles. I agree. <laughs> But, it, I mean, I'm terrible at those games where you have like a, a, a jar and you have to guess the number of jelly beans in it. I'm over here like, okay, well, what's the dimension of a jelly bean? What's the dimension of a jar? All right, let me uh, give you a number and then I'm way off. <laughs> James Sesson says, will this be on the test at the end of the semester? End of the semester? No, 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 at the end of, the, the end of class tonight, James. <laughs> Leo says, the pylons are my favorite centerpieces of this main entrance plaza. Yeah, the pylons, these uh, clear plastic pylons here are beautiful. And yes, Marty, I'm exactly, there is nothing like it anywhere. Paul says, 43,890 million sides. Not. Nah. <laughs> <laughs> oh my goodness. Oh. It's really pretty here, though. It really like, is. So pretty, so peaceful. All we need is the squirrel that was eating the popcorn to join us. Right? That was such a cute squirrel. It was. 
I do wonder whether or not they're going to retire the 50th anniversary show on the on Spaceship Earth, though. I'd have to assume so. so. This might be one of the last times we'll ever see it. If not the last time, because I don't know if we'll uh, come see them. Uh... Oh, here we go, everybody. Peaceful uh, show. <laughs> yeah, there's just a lot of um, spring breakers. It's going to yeah. be for a little while, but um, it's entertaining because you know he knows where it is. <laughs> it's going to get some boba. <laughs> the boba. Oh man. The boba does sound pretty good over at the China food booth, though. Oh, Gotta yeah? admit, <laughs> it does sound pretty delicious. We'll have to try it soon. It is just so pretty. Yeah, and that was the colors of the wind one. And they do that one specifically for the Flower and Garden Festival. So it'll be here for the festival. Yep. It's one of my favorites. Yeah, it's beautiful. And then they will do uh, probably the 50th anniversary one next. That will probably be in the next uh, six, excuse me, got the hiccups all of a sudden, <laughs> six minutes. Is that Coca-Cola water. <laughs> It's the Beverly. The be oh yeah, it was that Beverly you drank. I don't know why you drank that Beverly. Revenge of the Beverly. Oh my goodness, it's so gross. 
Have you guys had Beverly in the chat? And if so, what do you think of it out of curiosity? Because I'd love to know. I absolutely despise the taste of Beverly. But Eric <laughs> says it's actually okay. It's, it's not great. It's just not bad. I mean, it's like something I'd drink if I was like dying of thirst and there was like nothing else <laughs> as an option, you know? <laughs> yes, exactly, Shannon. It is a geeky cryo, uh, Greek, a geeky cryo, cakeosphere, a geeky cryo cakeosphere. <laughs> You're talking about cakes? I like cakes. Frozen <laughs> cakes, apparently. Nerdy frozen cakes. Awesome. Beverly is bitter and it is an instant regret if you're not prepared for it, absolutely. Yes, Marty, I'm, it was so pretty. Hey, yes, Amigo says, love these light shows. I love how James Sisson and Mr. Disney King are both like, nope, won't do it. <laughs> no Beverly for us. Shannon's like, gross. Literary Plus 2 is saying, wish Walt had seen it finished, probably would be a different park today. That's for sure. That is for sure. Yeah, completely agreed with that. Shannon was, uh, oh yeah, that's what you're talking about. Uh, cake, okay, great. <laughs> uh, frozen cake, got it. James, nope. Mr. Disney King, Beverly is bitter and instant regret. Yes, exactly, Mr. Disney King. That's how I feel as well. The shift manager, I've only been to Epcot once. I have a special memory. I got it to perform with my high school choir at Epcot as part of the Magic Music Days. That's, That's awesome. really, really awesome. Very cool. Shannon D for Disney, gross, yes. Beverly is gross, 100%. <laughs> the mayor the says, mayor. hey, park conference yesterday, I was a delivery man. Today, I'm the meatball man. <laughs> you get those uh, meatballs, the mayor. The mayor, your family eats good. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh my goodness. Marty M said, I will never forget the surprise of tasting Beverly for the oh, first time. Oh, no, you were surprised? Oh, my gosh, Marty M. Yeah, I think I've always known it was, like, a bad drink. <laughs> <laughs> it's not bad to those who like it. Greg Titus says, I would try it once. Exactly, Greg. Yeah, we're very much of the, you know, philosophy. Try it once and then you'll know. Exactly. <laughs> Everybody has different taste buds. You can't, you know, well say something's good, but that doesn't mean you, you, you'll you think it's good, you know? Exactly. That's why we always say in our opinion, or at least we try to. Yep. Paul was saying, true literary plus two. What wanted his Epcot city built if he had lived longer? Yeah. yeah. We've been enjoying, uh, well, we enjoyed actually the uh, Imagineering story on Disney Plus. Yeah. Gave us a lot of insight. It did. It was, it was a, a great series. It was a beautiful series. Yeah. <laughs> All right, where would you like to see Harmonious from tonight, honey? Because we have half an hour until Harmonious. Okay, we have, that's a good time. Yeah, well, uh, I don't know. My, watch another... my favorite spot is literally from like the entrance because I feel like you get the projections really well there. Yeah. What do you think? I think maybe we'll try for that tomorrow because I think it's probably going to be a little busy near the entrance tonight. Okay. I don't know. We, so do we, you... can, we can certainly uh, take a look at that. Do you want to do maybe then Italy? Because Italy is also a very good spot. Italy is amazing. I, I, think, I think I would favor Italy tonight. Uh, but if there's no one, like if there's room down front, then we'll do down front. Yeah, we'll see what the crowds look like when we get there. Uh, Leo Epcot fan 21 is saying, Beverly is bitter, but when a tourist like myself goes, every so often, I embrace the opportunity. Absolutely. For sure. Got to. Mr. Disney King was saying, now I would say that for someone who visits annually a few times to Epcot, I must try Beverly every year visit just to see if I end up liking it. So far, nope. <laughs> that is a good strategy, like a good, like, try it every time you come, you know, and be like, is it going to be different this time? That's why I had it when we first went to Club Cool. Yeah. Our first time when, it, after it's been renovated and everything, I was like, you know, I'm going to try Beverly again. And I was like, nope. Oh, nope. 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 No, thank you. <laughs> uh, Mr. Disney King was saying this is your last few chances. Get a good spot. That's, oh, that's true. true. We do really like the front spot, but we also do really like the spot in Italy. I think those yeah. are very, those are two excellent viewing points for I, any of the uh, nighttime spectaculars here at Epcot. Yeah, I would argue and uh, venture to say that that might be the best two spots in Epcot to see Harmonious from. Yeah, Marty M says if you're going to Italy, you better start going soon. That That's is a, a fair a point. Very as well. <laughs> good point. That what is do you... also why I asked. Maybe after yeah. this next show, we'll uh, start hustling that way. Yeah, after the next show. I think that's a great idea. Yeah, because the next one will start within a minute. Yeah, let's enjoy the next light show, everybody. And then we'll head over into World Showcase to get a spot for Harmonious. Sounds good to me. 
Yeah, and thank you guys again so much for hanging out with us, hanging out with us today. And thank you, of course, to all the ninja watchers. We know you're there. And we, we appreciate you. you. Well, we don't see you, but we well, appreciate no. you just as much. Yeah, exactly. And we like to show our appreciation because we think we're very thankful. Absolutely. Here we go, guys. Enjoy. Right, guys so that was the beacons of magic that is the show that uh, first came with the 50th anniversary and like uh, marty m said that might have been one of the last times we'll ever see this show hopefully not hopefully they continue it uh after the 50th anniversary is over but, we'll but uh we'll definitely have to see all right honey i'm gonna hand this over to you sounds good and we'll make our way into uh the world showcase yeah And again, I, I think uh, if we find a good spot up front, cool. But otherwise, uh, we'll make our way over to Italy. What do you think? We'll see um, the crowds we encounter when we head that way. True. And we're sorry about that little bit of a green tinge that comes out on Spaceship Earth, if you guys see that. It's just the way that the uh, camera captures the light and the color and the angle. Cameras don't like blue light. Yeah, the blue is uh, a little difficult comes in at frequencies that uh, don't behave real well. <laughs> That's true. Welcome back, Cassidy. Welcome back, welcome back, <laughs> Eggs 663. Hey, Cassidy, hey, Eggs. Thank you for being here, guys. Yeah, and we always understand. We're here whenever you guys want to join us. If you have to do things, we totally understand, and we appreciate the time you spend with us. Exactly. Theo Samigo says, looks A-OK -okay to me. 
awesome. So pretty. And like, it's not just like how pretty it is, just like the music and the ambiance and just the whole atmosphere. Epcot. Just so, yeah, Epcot. <laughs> So we are going to be making our way in towards World Showcase and seeing what the crowds are looking like. Yeah, exactly. Hey Tyler, welcome back, unless you've been here, not sure. <laughs> <laughs> That's another thing, I don't like saying welcome back if somebody's been there the whole time, it's like I don't know, but just hi and thank yeah. you for being here. Well, we're saying welcome back to the chat, like if we haven't seen you in chat for a little bit. Yeah, that's true. We're welcoming you back to the chat. So. Exactly. Oh, sure thing, uh, Leo. We love uh, streaming these shows. The shows are just so beautiful. We could probably just pull up a chair and just sit here and <laughs> stare at Spaceship Earth all night long. Yeah, we could. <laughs> we get a bit mesmerized by the uh, by the giant geodesic sphere above us right now. Give us a coffee and we're set. <laughs> right. Wow, is there like no line for Spaceship Earth right now? There is no line for Spaceship That's Earth wild. right now. Look guys, if you want to go in Spaceship Earth, <laughs> go to uh, Spaceship Earth close to the uh, fireworks. Oh yeah. Well, close to the fireworks is the time you want to get on anything usually. That's true. If you're not interested in seeing the fireworks, usually those are going to be some of your lowest wait times. Exactly. But we definitely want to get a good spot for Harmonious, so Absolutely. that is where we're heading. Well, thank you, Nathan. Welcome in, by the way. Hey, welcome back, Nathan. Nathan says 2.41K. Congratulations, Bar oh, Well, thank, thank you, you so much, much, everybody. Thank you, guys. We really appreciate that. And guys, if you are new here, uh, which I don't know how many of you might be new here, but if you're new here. If you are. <laughs> uh, please consider subscribing. We'd love to have you along with us again in the future. And that does help to grow that number. So thank you so it much, It helps everybody. grow our channel immensely. So. It really does. Thank you all very much. Oh, thank you, Marty M. Thank you, Marty M. And Greg wants to know, do you think they'll get rid of the statues? Do you think what? That they'll get rid of the uh, statues? The 50th oh, anniversary like at Golden Magic statues? Kingdom? Yeah. Oh, they have them in all the parks, I guess. Yeah, they do. I just, when you say golden statues, I typically, I guess, I first think of uh, Magic Kingdom. Oh. I don't know why. I'm not sure. But <laughs> uh, I have heard rumor that they will keep those, which I mean, is they worked. They worked really hard on those. Right. And I don't know. It is the 50th. Yeah. Unless they just take off the 50th. Um, yeah, I think that's what they'll do is they'll take off the 50th uh, emblem on the mall and uh, yeah. put something else on instead. I can see Maybe that. Maybe 100 or something, you know? Wow, Starbucks is busy. Oh, yeah. Just... Like, the line's not long, but the wait for the coffee is very long. Do you want to... Uh, run through the Odyssey Pavilion on our way out to Italy or? Oh, that would be great. You wanna do that? All right, let's head to the left then. Okay. I'm gonna throw this away real quick. Okay, Anna. <laughs> Should we go back in for more water? <laughs> no, probably not. Do you want no. more water? I don't know. I'm a little thirsty. Okay. Well, we can go get more water. Yeah. Leo Epcot fan says, I'll tell you this much. I don't know what happened to Golden Figment. No clue. Don't look at me. Marty M said, I keep wondering if you're hungry. I'm very thirsty. I'm mostly thirsty. It's just, it's so hot. It's very hot. Um, maybe a little hungry. <laughs> <laughs> Hi. If I can bother you for a cup of water. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you. It was actually pretty good. <laughs> a yes, little yes. bit, yeah. Hi again, guys. Yes, yeah, staying hydrated is a very important part of running around in the park. Yeah, space. it really is. Thank, Thank you, you so, so much. much. Have a good night. Thank you. Thank you. 
Okay. I was like, did they bring back the Sprite? <laughs> no, it is gone for the evening. Might be gone for a little bit. They've got to get the uh, shipments of the syrup in. Oh, that's so refreshing. <laughs> <laughs> it really is. We're big water fans. Oh, yeah. I love coconut water, too. Thank you, sir. I don't know why I threw that out there. That was very random. I'm sorry. <laughs> Does anybody else like coconut water? For those of you who don't know, six hours does tend to be our longest stream, and we are coming up on six hours pretty quickly. So if we start to say some loopy, <laughs> I am silly a little. Things. I guess I am a little loopy. Sorry, guys. Uh, I am hydrating though. That's what's important. <laughs> yes, you should hydrate too. Thank you. All right, off to find a good spot to enjoy Harmonious this evening. Yep. And on our way, we'll be cutting through the Odyssey Pavilion. Yes. Let's take a look and see if we can find your munchling. I hope so. Oh, somebody had on the uh, scent of Norway. Oh, yeah? Yeah. Because you could, like you could uh, spray it on in the store as well. Gotcha. I love the scent of Norway. <laughs> Hey, welcome back, Greg Titus. Hey, Greg Titus. Welcome back, Sharice. Oh, yes, in smoothies is very good, too. Oh, traffic jam. A little bit. Marnie says, Monica, you. good luck. Oh, with what? Finding the uh, munch thing, I think. <gasps> oh, thank you, Marty. Um, I don't think he's going to be here just yet. Yeah. But... Maybe, you know, you know, he'll probably be restocked when we're blocked out from the parks next week. Probably. <laughs> because that's when he arrived. That's fair. They uh, released the orange bird munchling that uh, previous week we were blocked out. And I bet you they'll restock you <laughs> when we're blocked out again. That's entirely possible. Tyler, uh, there is a much larger Coca-Cola store in Disney Springs. Oh, yeah. But that is definitely a large Coca-Cola co uh, Coca shop. It is. But yeah, the one at Disney Springs is like, what, five stories? Um, it, I think it's three. Is it three? I don't know. Oh, uh, one, two, maybe it's four? Three or I four, think four. something like that. I'm not sure. We uh, showed it in great detail the last time we were at Disney Springs uh, during the holidays. I think so, yeah. So it'll be in one of our Disney Springs uh, live stream vlogs if you want to check it out. Oh, well, live streams. Yep, live streams. <laughs> yeah. Oh, something happened. Hopefully good. All right. We have made it to the citrus blossom. Let's see what's inside. <laughs> you can go through the building and go out the other side. Where do you go out there? Alicia says, I love coconut, but I don't care much for coconut water. Oh, gotcha. Yeah, and a lot of the coconut waters are different. Like, different brands taste different. It's kind of weird. <sighs> Let's see. Is it here? Is it here? Not seeing anything right now. I don't think so. They have a lot of the Tupperware. <laughs> they do have a lot of the Tupperware, that is for sure. They have a lot of the festival merch. So if you just wanted the festival merch, you could just come to the Odyssey. It's kind of all in one place. Yep. Makes it very convenient. I was like, is it behind the counter? No, I don't think so. I'm going to ask, though. Sorry to bug you, boss, but uh, your orange bird munchling, has that been out of stock since it was first sold? So we didn't receive here. Gotcha. We might have a creation, creation, but I'm not sure because it gotcha. could have been like sold out. Yeah. yeah. Gotcha. I looked everywhere over there. The, the orange bird munchling? So it was only sold at Creation. Only at Creation. Oh, okay. Never okay. had it. Um, I don't know. They only had it for, I want to say, 20,000 of them was, I believe, the number they said. I might Ooh. be wrong on that. Gosh. So whatever they had was what they had in the limited edition copy. Any gotcha. word if it's going to be restocked or anything? No, it was limited edition, so it was like one and done. Oh, I was wow. hoping it was going to be like the figment, you know, for the last festival. Yeah. There was like a 
thousands. That was technically also limited edition. I just think people didn't buy it as much. That yeah. one I was able to get, but this one, they came out when uh, we were blocked out of the park that week. Mm -hmm. And I'm like, really? Now's the time you guys release it? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. All right, oh, thank you guys. Thank you so much. Appreciate Have a good night. It. So it is not going to be restocked. Right. Good to know. That is. I could stop my hunt, sadly. We also do like this spot, but not nearly as good as the main entrance spot where it is. Right. Yeah, this is more of a convenience spot if you're wanting to uh, leave quickly. Oh, that's like, true. Oh no, the mayor said, oh, I'm sorry. I keep forgetting that this is my dad's phone. Oh, so the mayor is really Megan in disguise. <laughs> it feels like a uh, Scooby-Doo episode where you just rip off the mask and it's really Megan underneath the mayor's face. Megan incognito. It really is beautiful out here. Absolutely, Bravo Zulu. Nice when the people just say hi to the camera. Right. I'm like, oh, that's very nice. Welcome back, Bravo Zulu. Welcome back, Bravo Zulu. Okay, so the mayor says, haha, I took my phone back for a moment. Is it really the mayor? Or is it Or is Megan? it still Megan? <laughs> we'll never know. <laughs> Who's Tiana's best friend? The mayor. Ooh, good question. Oh, so we get an answer we know it's Megan. There you go. <laughs> <laughs> it's both of us, Marty, says the mayor. <laughs> <laughs> That's awesome. Uh, Kayla, Monica, your Spanish is better than mine. Oh, thank you so much. That's very kind. Oh, the Lotus House. I think that's the place that has the boba. Oh, that makes sense. Yeah, that would be good. You want to try it? No, no, no. I want to get to our spot. Okay. Just because, I mean, it is a pretty crowded night. 
That's fair. And they're already shutting down the booths anyways, so. Fair. MD Not Shingle the best time to go. <laughs> MD Shingleton, Deputy Chief 11. Yes. Hey, said, great uh, to see you. Welcome in. Welcome in. Do you know if the Citrus Blossom will be open after the Flower and Garden Festival, or is it just a seasonal thing? Um, so, well, the Citrus Blossom itself is for the Flower and Garden Festival. The location itself is called the Odyssey Pavilion. And they've been opening it up and theming it for all the festivals. Exactly. Like, so, different. So it'll be closed more than likely in between the festivals while it gets rethemed for the next festival. But when there is a festival going on, there will be, you know, merchandise in there, there will be food, food in there, drinks, other tables. things like that. A good spot to sit and relax. Exactly. We hope that answered the question. <laughs> I was like, oh no, I'm in that person's way, but he wanted to be on the camera. Yeah. Got it. Okay. <laughs> Spring break. Spring break. And you're entitled to your own opinion of World's Greatest Dude, absolutely. Uh, we like it because it was the first one that we saw together here at Epcot. Yeah. And on top of that, I, I just enjoy the music personally. Yeah, everybody has their own opinions on if they enjoy it or not. and. We respect that very much. Absolutely. Yeah, personally, we very much enjoy it, Tom. But just because we like it doesn't mean you have to. Exactly. But we are looking forward to Epcot forever. We are. Be really curious to see how that goes. Yeah. I was also keeping an eye on the booths to see if they had the munchling. Oh. Monica it, is not done with her hunt yet. She I, has not given I don't up. Wanna, I don't want to <laughs> give up easily. But the fact that uh, that cast member uh, was very sure of what she was saying. Yeah. Yeah, she was like, they only came out at the creation shop and they sold out, like, officially. I'm like, no! <laughs> there are so many figment ones for the last festival. And they were there for, like, months. Yeah. These went away in, like, days. Yep. Sadly. That is how it goes, unfortunately. But it's good to know. All right, guys, so we have eight minutes before Harmonious. We are making our way over to the Italy Pavilion. Oh, that's awesome, Mary Carol. Thank you so much. Adam and Blake, that's awesome. Hello, Adam. Hello, Blake. Hello, guys. Those are the names of uh, Mary Carol's two cats. Yes, I remember. Oh, I'm sorry. I said hi to them earlier. Oh. I'm sorry, I, I missed the <laughs> comment earlier then. Oh. Well, earlier, like, during daytime, so. Yeah. A lot's happened between now and then. <laughs> 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 to be fair. All right, we're almost at the spot for the fireworks in Italy. Almost there. With about seven to eight minutes to spare. Yep. Made good time. <laughs> The mayor says we're excited to experience Festival of the Holidays one day. Yeah, that'd be awesome, guys. Festival of the Holidays is one of our favorites just because, well, it's one, the holidays. we love Christmas. <laughs> <laughs> and it's very, very, like, cheerful and decorative and just beautiful. <laughs> I think it's always beautiful, but especially for the holidays. Oh, yeah. Oh, there's a, um event. Certainly is. Could be a wedding, could be a corporate uh, corporation. Yeah, could be a number Not of things. Sure. But they got food. They do have food. And it food. smells good. Oh, this is why Marty M says I'm hungry. I keep saying all the food smells good. Yep. This makes sense, Marty M. <laughs> I'm now connecting the dots. So this area right here is usually not this busy. It is not. But they did rip off a good chunk over here. They did. What do you think, like right here? Or do you want to try to get in there? Oh, I don't want to try to get in there. Oh, the Spaceship Red looks pretty. Welcome back, Megan. Yeah, I think like right back here. But you got to factor in the fact that people are going to stand. I know, I'm okay. going to put it up high. Gotcha. <laughs> yeah, I guess here's good. Because either that or we have to go find another spot. Yeah. It really won't work. Yeah, it's going to have to be here. Yep. All right. And then when you are ready. 
Yeah. I'll just have you take that. Thank you. Yeah, it's a little more crowded than usual, this uh, spot we usually see the fireworks from Italy. Oh, yeah. So I'm glad we came over here instead of the main area. But tomorrow we'll definitely be seeing them from the main area. Oh, yeah. We'll just get there early. Exactly. Hey, Elsa Samoro. Welcome in. Great to see you again. Hey, Elsa. Good evening. Tonight, we invite you to join us for harmonious, spectacular celebration Just be careful there. The yep. Magic that happens when the music connects us around the world. Due to lower life levels, we ask that you please watch your step. Oh, no worries at all. Elsa says, I'm not in the mood to talk much. No worries at all. We totally Thank you understand so much Elsa. for saying hi. Yeah. And we hope you enjoy the stream and enjoy harmonious. Thank Absolutely. you for being here. And we hope your day improves. Yes. Oh, the mayor's off to bed. Good night, the mayor. Good night, mayor. Or is this Megan? No. <laughs> <laughs> no, Megan's in under her name now. Oh, okay, gotcha. Yeah. Good night, mayor. Good Thank night, you for mayor. being here, sir. you up high here. That's very true, Dan's life at the Kingdom. Uh, we'll do whatever we can in order to get it back up later. Yeah. Uh, but, but for now, we'll, we love uh, Harmonious and we love showing it to you guys, so. Exactly. We just want you to enjoy, you know, Harmonious. Well, we still can. <laughs> but thank you so much. Thank you for the heads up. We appreciate that. We have about four minutes. Till showtime. Gotcha. Let's sit this here. Why don't we put that in the pocket Where the uh, umbrella is? Oh, never mind. Gotcha. I can put it inside. I got it. It stays right there. Thank you. All right, let's get this going here. Oh yeah. Yeah, we totally understand Dan's life of the kingdom. It's It's been a really frustrating situation, but uh, yeah. you know. It has. All right guys, so we have less than uh, three minutes before we begin our fireworks. And thank you so much, Marty M. Shared out our Instagram link. Thank you, Marty M. Thank you so much, Marty M. Guys, we do have Instagram uh, where we are Park Hoppers FL, and we also have a TikTok. And if you guys care to follow us on those platforms, that'd be awesome as well. Absolutely. Thank you. Yes, exactly, Alicia. They are blocking it because it is on Disney Plus. Thank you. Oh. Yeah, just press some buttons. Oh, please. Okay. There we go. All right. Let's go right there. Let's bring it up a little bit. Get this one going here. Hang in there, everybody. Yeah, I was Perfect. I'm gonna hold this one for both of us. So oh, I'll... thank you. And then we'll clip it. Mm -hmm. Well, that'd be amazing, Dan. Thank you for watching with us. Yeah, we just, we really love Harmonious. We do. But oh. 
with everything in Disney, always got to look forward to what's fresh and what's new because it's always going to improve. It is. All right, guys, we hope you enjoy Harmonious. It's about to begin. Enjoy Harmonious, everyone. Voices calling out in search of one another. We find each other in song.
soarings, and the whole wide world will hear it. harmonious everybody we will miss it we will definitely miss it there. yeah thank you guys so much for enjoying harmonious with us thank you everybody oh that was beautiful always is thank you he'll drink some more i'm gonna throw away um by the trash up there gotcha leave me one sip though <laughs> you got it Oh, sorry about that, Ticketman friend. Yes, please make sure you guys are on 1080p. Oh, yeah, we're on 1080p, guys. Make sure your live icon is red. If not, try refreshing. And we have done a lot of stuff in the last six hours, guys. Please know <laughs> that uh, more than likely this stream will be taken down oh, yeah. shortly after we end tonight. Uh, if that does indeed happen, we'll do everything we can to get it back up. But and if we can't, it was worth enjoying Harmonious for one of the last times we will be able to enjoy Harmonious because we love it. So. Exactly. That's what it's about, sharing, yeah. you know, all the Disney awesomeness. And thank you guys so much for joining us to watch it. Exactly. Uh, do you want to, I would say, scoot up, but like there's. I think a lot here of is fine there. because yeah. I, I don't think the crowds are leaving that fast. I don't think so. All right, let's Where just, do you want to. Let's bring them down just a little further right. here. Hold on a second. Yeah. Hi. Good call. All right, guys. Let so, me get that. Oh, we are nine likes away from 300, everybody. Nine likes from That's 300? Crazy. Thank you guys so much. Thank you, everybody. That's we awesome. We are out of focus as well. <laughs> we there definitely we are. Yes, exactly, John. They are going to do the after show. Uh, usually people will clear out before that, though. Yeah, we'll see if they clear out for the post show so we can enjoy a little bit of that. Yeah. Um, let me go throw this away in the trash can. Sounds good. Over. Yep. I'll be right back. And guys, if you have not already uh, hit that like button or tap that like button, whatever you want to say, uh, please consider doing so. We're very close to 300 likes. That's amazing. Thank you, each and every one of you. We really appreciate that. We have had an amazing day with all of you. Thank you so much. This is uh, the post show for Harmonious that's about to happen right now. Uh, when this post show is over, uh, I think everything in the park except Creations uh, will be closed. Hey, hey. Thank you so much, Greg. We appreciate that. Thank you, Greg. We can get a bit closer if you want. Let's let a few more people clear out and we'll... Uh, yeah, it's just, it, I think it's going to clear out in just a few more moments. People are just taking photos and then they're uh, walking away. Exactly. For now, we'll definitely continue enjoying the post show. I saw a few uh, new friends that joined us in chat. I see uh, Green Giants, welcome in. Holly M, welcome back. Hey Tiki Man Phantom, welcome in. Let's see. Yeah, thank you guys so much for hanging out. It's been a blast today. Thank We've you done guys. so much. We really have. And for the very first time, we saw the uh, the hoedown over by uh, oh, yeah. Country Bear Jamboree. In Frontierland over yeah. at Magic Kingdom, that was fun. That was fun. Guys, 
Let's scoot a little closer here. <laughs> Megan G. A few hours ago, Monica said, we can hammer the like button. I might try that. <laughs> yeah, we were like, um, somebody was talking about construction. I think Eric was talking with them about construction or something. I think Plymouth Rock is a carpenter. Oh, so they were talking about construction. So we're like, you know, hammer the like button. Yeah. One of those things. But just not like with a real hammer, because that would be bad. <laughs> right. Yes, Holly M, the dancing Chip and Dale at the hoedown were great. Oh, thank Absolutely. you, John. Thank you guys for joining us. Thank you, guys. One oh, more like to 300? Oh, my goodness. That's thank you for the update, thank Marty M. And then we'll scooch right over here. I was so spoiled if you look at what it says under flowers. Yes, Paul, hope you had an thank awesome you. dinner. Thank you for coming back. 300 likes. Thank you so much, everybody. <gasps> oh, really my gosh. That. That's awesome. Thank you, guys. Put your right foot in, yes, exactly. <laughs> Pretty much. Those are the easy, the easy part, the easier parts <laughs> of the hoedown. Chip and Dale were so cute though. They and were. then you got to see like Big Al, Liver Lips McGraw, like a bunch of the country bear jamboree ones. Clarabelle was there, Horace, like so cool. We'll have to see it again in the future. <laughs> Megan said they might, uh, Dan Disney is always bringing retired shows out of the shadows for a short time. That's true. Disney does have a tendency to do that. Uh, it would be difficult to bring back Harmonious though. Once they get rid of the barges, it would be very difficult to bring this back. Yeah. Uh, once the barges are gone exactly, I don't think they'll bring back Harmonious. Not to say they might not uh, do it ever, but not anytime soon. I like uh, Ron's idea of just put it in, uh, in Animal Kingdom. <laughs> Oh, Paul. Wow, 300 likes. Hammering it must work, LOL. <laughs> hope Megan didn't break hers, LOL. <laughs> we hope not. Um, who's going to answer the call? The magic keeps hanging up on me. Oh, it's no, Marty Leo. Marty M's got to answer the call. Marty M's got to answer the call. <laughs> oh, man. We're definitely going to enjoy harmonies again tomorrow, guys. So, yep. um... But it will be the last time we get to see Harmonious. It will be our last time enjoying Harmonious, yeah. It's kind of like crazy to think of. Yeah. Well, oh, that's a good it. idea, Megan. Put them in Animal Kingdom and have World of Color. That would be beautiful. That would yeah, be. like some kind of World of Color situation in Animal Kingdom. They have a lot of space and that might be like, that would be a great idea if they did something with that. It would be. Oh no, James Sisson was like, wonder if the barges will turn up at the Lakeland Antique Mall. <laughs> oh boy. I, I don't know. They put a lot of money into those. They I, I would assume they're going to repurpose them for something. Right? I would hope so, but I also don't know what they would repurpose it. Like, oh. Unless they're going to move it to another park. Yeah. I don't know what they're going to do with these. So Rilo, uh, welcome in by the way. Welcome the, in Rilo. The very last showing of Harmonious will be the very last uh, showing of Enchantment, which is Sunday. Uh, March 2nd, I believe, or April 2nd, excuse me, wrong month, April 2nd. So we ourselves won't be in the park on the weekend. Yeah, our uh, pass blocks us out on the weekends, that's the only reason. Right, so Enchantment, the last time we get to enjoy Enchantment is going to be Friday. Yeah. And the last time we'll enjoy Harmonious will be tomorrow. Tomorrow, yeah. It does retire on April 2nd. Yep. And then Epcot Forever will be taking its place. Exactly. So much wind right now. There is a lot of wind right now. So pretty. It really is. Yeah, I mean, in Animal Kingdom, it would just be really awesome if they brought back something for the nighttime spectacular. Are there, I mean, they have the the projections on the Tree of Life, which is right. beautiful, don't get me wrong. But that's like the projections but on uh, Spaceship, Spaceship Earth. Earth. They need, yeah, something a little extra for the nighttime would be nice. Well, they also aren't open in the nighttime. They really need to open for the nighttime. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Greg, we know. Uh, no worries, we'll take care of it. Yeah. Thank you. It's, we don't want you guys to worry ever about any of those things. What no. we want like for you guys is just to enjoy Disney and, and just relax and have a good time with us. Yep. But thank you so much. We really appreciate that. 
All right, Meridian. <laughs> Marty's answering the call. <laughs> Oh, Greg, it's not a bad idea. No, no. Um, we're just saying we like for you guys just to relax and like have a good time, you know? Exactly. But we always, always appreciate any input and help because we appreciate it. <laughs> we're still kind of new to all this. I mean. Oh, yeah, for sure. We haven't yet hit our first year and, uh, you know, we're going at it and learning as we go. So. Always. Yeah, we'll never stop learning. No nope. matter how many years we go into this, like. Learning is not something that's going to ever end. <laughs> Leo's like, nope, I'm not answering this time. Nope. <laughs> <laughs> Megan's like, I answered the call earlier and it was my dentist. <gasps> oh, no. Oh, no. Well, hopefully it was a good dentist call. I don't Fingers know. Fingers crossed. Is any call with the dentist a good call? <laughs> I don't know. It depends. Marty, I'm telling Jose, sure. Jose, phone is going to stop ringing soon. Oh. Yep. That it is, is true. <laughs> but, oh, you know, thank you so much, Gary G. Disney we will try. replace it with something good. So, looking forward to that. Yeah, Disney does a very good job with their nighttime spectaculars. They really do. Well, with everything, in our opinion. <laughs> we love Disney. Oh, she had to reschedule her appointment again. Sorry about that, Megan. Let's see if I can put this here. Yeah, that'll work. Beautiful. So pretty. And one of the reasons we really love this spot in Italy is because you can enjoy the space, like the Spaceship Earth light show uh -huh. behind it. Like, how pretty is that? It is very pretty. All right, you want to turn it around, honey? <laughs> Tyler's like. That water looks inviting. Time for a quick swim. Yeah. <laughs> okay. We would not recommend that. It's maybe not the cleanest of waters. <laughs> maybe not. All right. Do you want oh. on this side, honey? Yes, or? I yeah. do want that. Okay. Yes. Do you want to put this, this back? Ooh. Make sure you sure. lower that. Like, that is as low as it goes. Oh, is it as low yep. as it goes? That certainly is. That yeah. one's so bright. Okay. Well, whenever you're ready, right. turn it around. Let's do it. So hello everybody. Hi everybody. Thank you so That's much great. for it is great. Thank you great so much day. for for spending the day with us, everybody. We're clearly cuckoo. Uh, yeah, we're losing a little loopy. Minds. Let's turn it a little bit more here so we have spaceship earth centered. Oh yeah, spaceship earth in there the background. Yes. Very pretty. So guys, thank you so much for spending. Uh, and nearly six hour day with us again. Nearly. Like, that's crazy. Thank you so much. We really appreciate that. Yeah, we started here at Epcot. We did? We went to Magic. Yep. We did a whole bunch of things. We enjoyed did. a bunch of cavalcades. Enjoyed, enjoyed the uh, musical stylings of Neil. Musical stylings of Neil over Casey's Corner twice. Yep. So good. Um, more cavalcades. More cavalcades. The hoedown. The hoedown, yep. which was amazing with was. Chip and Dale. They were hilarious. All the country bears. Horace, oh Clarabelle, like so cool. We'll They're have to we'll too. have to watch that again sometime. Mm -hmm. So good. Uh, what else did we do? Uh, the train. The train. Yep. Yeah, we rode the railroad all around. Um, then we just did, then we came back here, right? Um, I'm like, I feel like I'm forgetting some stuff. We did the train. Then we did uh, the last cavalcade one more time. We enjoyed the Emporium a few times. We went times. to the Emporium <laughs> a yeah. few times, to we, say uh, the least. Yeah, we uh, came back here. We went to Creations. We went to Club Cool. Oh yeah, Club Cool. Got uh, some water, and Eric uh, drank Beverly. Why? Yeah, I, mean, I don't know. Because you're in Club Cool, you've got to drink Beverly. No, you know, it's it's. Uh, I'm not doing it. I refuse. It's a tradition. Yeah. Refuse. Help them in, Mama Bear One. Hey, Mama Bear One. No, you're good, Mama Bear One. Don't worry. Yeah, we we enjoy harmonious, and we enjoy showing you guys harmonious, regardless of whatever happens. Yep. Yeah. Well, I mean, like, if anything, it just goes down for a little bit and we'll figure it out. Yep, exactly. No worries. So thank you guys so much for spending the whole day with us. Once we got back over here after uh, Creations and after uh, Club Cool, uh, Club Cool, we enjoyed some of the uh, shows on Spaceship Earth. Yeah, we and we did Living to... with the Land. Oh, we did do Living with the Land. I, I love Living, living with, with the Land. So nice. Always so peaceful. And then we also uh, did... Um, 
Harmonious. I mean, I guess we came around and yeah. did Harmonious next, yeah. And now we're here. So, we thank you guys so very much for joining us today. Thank you, Thank everybody. you again so much to all our awesome, awesome moderators who we cannot do this without at exactly. all. Thank you, thank you. Um, let's see here. We also want to thank our Patreon members. Thank you, everybody. Um, and of course, all the Super Chats. Thank you always for the Super Chats. Very much appreciated. Never expected, but very much appreciated, guys. Thank you. Thank so you. Much, guys. And then um, we have our list of Patreon members to say thank you to each and every one of you. So, big thank you to Kenneth H., Sunshine and Disney Time, Melanie, Jennifer Caruso, MH, Grasshopper and Grasshopper's wife, and Little Grasshopper. Little Grasshopper. Megan Grant, DW Hartwich, uh, oh, excuse me, uh, Theo <laughs> Sam Eagle, The Three Musketeers UK, that's Bex and Andy, Jill Walkbrit, Robbie Taylor, Drew's Magical Legacy, Matt Merle, Kay Wilby, JJ Mickey, <coughs> excuse me, Speaker and Honeydew. Brands Adventures, Cherise B, Sam B, Jeff Condon, the, the mayor, mayor, Liam Does Disney, Ramon Valderrama, and Lynn Butler. Thank you I was so trying much, to help with the last part of this. I don't know why he had to like. My why can't he just let me? I'll try all this I time. know, but like I can help too. I know. And then you like didn't let like, me I've do it. This. You didn't I've let me. You didn't let me. Why? So I can help. Thank you again so much to all of our ninja watchers, all of our subscribers, all of our chatters, everyone who is here today. Thank you so much. We truly appreciate you all. We will be back tomorrow here at Epcot at 4 p.m. Yeah. EDT. So we hope to see you all there. We would uh, love to see you. And hello to Juan Actis from Argentina. Bienvenidos. Bienvenidos. And Jeannie's here too. Hey, Jeannie. Hey, Jeannie. Thank you, guys. And if you're coming in or haven't already, please pop, tap, like, click that thumbs like button. This one? Or mm -hmm. this one? I, I one of those. One? That one? I don't know. I could be wrong. That one? Anyways, one of, one of those. That'd be awesome. Uh, if you'll consider subscribing. Mm -hmm.